kilio Tuache dunia Yenye magonjwa Alikuwa na sejana Safarini alikuwa na sejana leo ayuko tujia naye ni mipango ya Mungu haipanguki ili na loli na uma Hili na sikitisha Boyo Hewe kifo Kutujibu Bona Unachukua Mpaka wale Wanamtumikia mungu Hili ni swali Ninani umiza Boyo Hili ni swali Neri waza Kumbe Tuko safari ni sisi Kumbe Tunapita Nimi pango ya mungu Haipanguki Halikuwa na sejana Leo ayupo Tujiandaye wakusi pango ya mungu Nafasi ndiyo hitu na hai Kesho yetu wakuna na ya ijua Siku za kuduniani Zina karibia kusha Ya tupasa Tujia ndahe Na yo safari Ya tupasa Tujia ndahe Kwenda minguni Tuache mazoea Tukia mka Salamba Tuwache mazoea Tukimaliza siku salama Dunia ni tunapita Tuwa safiri Umeji ya naje Na safari Halikuwa na sejana Ayupo Leo ayupo Tunamu omboleza Siku zako zina karibia kuisha Siku zako zimesabiwa dugu ya Kila siku, siku yako ya kufa ina karibia Haipanguki Halikuwa na sejana Zako duniani zimesami wa nugu ya Kila siku unasongea kamulini Hakikisha kwa mbome panga maisha yako
Jamani wenzangu maisha yetu yako mikononi mwa Mungu. Unapoamka salama kumbuka tu kumwambia ni asante. Unapomaliza siku salama mwambie tu ni asante. Oh. Mapi. Hubu duniani sio kwetu tu wasafiri. Hubu duniani sio kwetu tunasafiri. Moja baada ya mwingine tunasafiri. Tunaelekea mbinguni kwenye maisha ya milele. Tuache dunia hii ya mahangaiko. Tuache dunia hii ya kuumiza moyo. Tuache dunia hii yenye kilio. Tuache dunia hii yenye magonjwa. Alikuwa na sijana. Safari ni alikuwa na sijana leo ayupo tujia naye ni mipango ya Mungu haipanguki hili nalo linauma Loli na sikitisha Boyo Hewe kifo Kutujibu Bona Unachukua Mpaka wale Wanamtumikia mungu Hili ni swali Ninani umiza Boyo Hili ni swali Ineri waza Kumbe Tuko safari ni sisi Kumbe Tunapita Alikuwa na sejana Leo ayupo Tunaoboneza Nimipango ya mwaka Nafasi ndiyo itu na hai Kesho yetu wakuna na ye ijua Siku zako duniani Zina karibia kusha Ya tupasa Tujia na ye Na yo safari Ya tupasa Tujia na ye Kwenda minguni Tuache mazoea Tukia mka Salamba Tuache mazoea Tukimaliza Siku salamba Dunia ni tunapita Tuwa safiri Umeji ya naje Na safari Alikuwa na sejana Ayupo Siku zako zina karibia kwisha Siku zako zime sabiwa dugu ya Kila siku, siku yako ya kufa ina karibia Haipanguki Alikuwa na sijana Siku zako duniani zimesami wa nugu ya Kila siku unasongea kamulini Akikisha kwa mbome panga maisha yako
Jamani wenzangu maisha yetu yako mikononi mwa Mungu. Unapoamka salama kumbuka tu kumwambia ni asante. Unapomaliza siku salama mwambie tu ni asante. Oh. Mapi. Humu duniani sio kwetu tu asafiri. Humu duniani sio kwetu tunasafiri. Moja baada ya mwingine tunasafiri. Tunaelekea mbinguni kwenye maisha ya milele. Tuache dunia hii ya mahangaiko. Tuache dunia hii ya kuumiza moyo. Tuache dunia hii yenye kilio. Tuache dunia hii yenye magonjwa alikuwa na sijana leo ayuko ni mifano ya Mungu haipanguki tuko safari ni alikuwa na sijana leo ayuko tujiandae Sikitisha Boyo Hewe kifo Kutujibu Bona Unachukua Mpaka wale Wanamtumikia mungu Hili niswali Ninani umiza Boyo Hili niswali Neri waza Kumbe Tuko safari ni sisi Kumbe Tunapita Alikuwa na sejana Leo ayumbo Tunaoboleza Nimipango ya mwaka Nafasi ndiyo itu na hai Kesho yetu wakuna na ye ijua Siku za koduniani Zina karibia kusha Ya tupasa Tujia na ye Na yo safari Ya tupasa Tujia na ye Kwenda minguni Tuache mazoea Tukia mka Salamba Tuache mazoea Tukimaliza siku salamba Dunia ni tunapita Tuwa safiri Umeji ya naje Na safari Halikuwa na sejana Hayupo Siku zako zina karibia kuisha Siku zako zime sabiwa dugu ya Kila siku, siku yako ya kufa ina karibia Haipanguki Halikuwa na sijana Siku zako duniani zimesami wa nugu ya Kila siku unasongea kamuhivu Hakikisha kwa mbombe panga maisha yako
Jamani wenzangu maisha yetu yako mikononi mwa Mungu. Unapoamka salama kumbuka tu kumwambia ni asante. Unapomaliza siku salama mwambie tu ni asante. Oh. Mapi. Hubu duniani sio kwetu tu asafiri. Hubu duniani sio kwetu tunasafiri. Moja baada ya mwingi Tunasafiri Tunaelekea mbinguni Kwenye maisha ya milele Tuache dunia hii Ya maanga iko Tuache dunia hii Ya kuumiza moyo Tuache dunia hii Yenye kilio Tuache dunia hii Yenye magonjwa Alikuwa na sijana Leo ayupo Nimipango ya mungu Haipanguki Tumo safari ni Alikuwa na sijana Sikitisha Boyo Hewe kifo Kutujibu Bona Unachukua Mpaka wale Wanamtumikia mungu Hili niswali Ninani umiza Boyo Hili niswali Ineli waza Kumbe Tuko safari ni sisi Kumbe Tunapita Alikuwa na sejana Leo ayumbo Tunaoboleza Nimipango ya mungu Nafasi ndiyo itu na hai Kesho yetu wakuna na ye ijua Siku za kodu ni ani Zina kalibia kusha Ya tupasa Tuji ya ndahe Na yo safari Ya tupasa Tuji ya ndahe Kwenda minguni Tuache mazoea Tukia mka Salamba Tuache mazoea Tukimaliza siku salamba Dunia ni tunapita Tuwa safiri Umeji ya naje Na safari Halikuwa na sejana Hayupo Siku zako zina karibia kwisha Siku zako zime sabiwa dugu ya Kila siku, siku yako ya kufa ina karibia Kila siku unasongea kamulini Hakikisha kwa mbome panga maisha yako
zamani wenzangu maisha yetu yako mikononi mwa Mungu unapoamka salama kumbuka tu kumwambia ni asante unapomaliza siku salama mwambie tu ni asante oh happy hebu duniani sio kwetu tu asafiri hebu duniani sio kwetu tunasafiri moja baada ya mwingi Tunasafiri Tunaelekea mbinguni kwenye maisha ya milele Tuache dunia hii ya mahangaiko Tuache dunia hii ya kuumiza moyo Tuache dunia hii Yenye kilio tuache dunia hii yenye magonjwa alikuwa na sijana leo ayupo ni mipango ya Mungu haipanguki tuwe safari ni alikuwa na sijana sikitisha boyo hewe kifo utujibu bona unachukua mpaka wale wanamtumikia mungu hili ni swali linani umiza boyo hili ni swali Waza Kumbe Tuko safari Ni sisi Kumbe Tunapita Alikuwa na sejana Leo ayumbo Tunaomboleza Nimipango ya mbo Nafasi ndiyo itu na hai Kesho yetu wakuna na ye ijua Siku za koduniani Zina karibia kusha Ya tupasa Tujia na ye Na yo safari Ya tupasa Tujia na ye Kuinda minguni Tuache mazoea Tukia mka Salamba Tuache mazoea Tukimaliza Siku salamba Dunia ni tunapita Tuwa safiri Umeji ya naje Na safari Halikuwa na sejana Hayupo
Mwani wenzangu, maisha yetu yako mikononi mwa mungu Unapu wabuka salama, kumbuka tuku muambia ni asande Unapu maliza siku salama, muambia tu ni asande Humu duniani, siya wetu, tuwa safiri Humu duniani, siya wetu, tuna safiri Mboja bada ya mwingi Tunasafiri Tunaelekea mpinguni Kwenye maisha ya milele Tuwache dunia hii Ya maanga hiko Tuwache dunia hii Ya kumiza moyo Tuwache dunia hii Yenye kilio Tuwache dunia Yenye magonjwa Alikuwa na sijanda Leo ayupo Nimipango ya mungu Haipanguki Tubo safari ni Alikuwa na sijanda Sikitisha Boyo Hewe kifo Kutujibu Kona Unachukua Mpaka wale Wanamtumikia mungu Kube Tunapita Alikuwa na sejanda Leo ayupo Tunaomboleza Nimipango ya mungu Haipanguki Alikuwa na sejanda Nafasi ndiyo hitu na hai Kesho yetu wakuna na ye ijua Siku za koduniani Zina karibia kusha Ya tupasa Tujia na ye Na yo safari Ya tupasa Tujia na ye Kuinda minguni Tuache mazoea Tukia mka Salamba Tuwache mazoea Tukimaliza siku salamba Tunia ni tunapita Tuwa safiri Umeji ya naje Na safari Halikuwa na sejana Ayupo Siku zako zina karibia kwisha Siku zako zime sabiwa dugu ya Kila siku, siku yako ya kufa ina karibia Siku zako duniani 
kazi zimehesabiwa ndugu yangu kila siku unasongea kaburini hakikisha kwamba umepanga maisha yako Jamani wenzangu maisha yetu yako mikononi mwa Mungu. Unapoamka salama kumbuka tu kumwambia ni asante. Unapomaliza siku salama mwambie tu ni asante. Oh, mapi. Hubu duniani sio kwetu tu wasafiri. Hubu duniani sio kwetu tunasafiri. Moja baada ya mwingi Tunasafiri Tunaelekea mbinguni kwenye maisha ya milele Tuache dunia hii ya mahangaiko Tuache dunia hii ya kuumiza moyo Tuache dunia hii Yenye kilio tuache dunia yenye magonjwa alikuwa na sijana leo ayupo nimepango ya Mungu haipanguki tuko safari ni alikuwa na sijana Sikitisha Boyo Hewe kifo Kutujibu Bona Unachukua Mpaka wale Wanamtumikia mungu Hili ni swali Ninani umiza Boyo Hili ni swali Neri waza Kumbe Tuko safari ni sisi Kumbe Tunapita Alikuwa na sejana Leo ayupo Tunaomboleza Nimipango ya mbo Nafasi ndiyo itu na hai Kesho yetu wakuna na ye ijua Siku za koduniani Zina karibia kusha Ya tupasa Tujia na ye Na yo safari Ya tupasa Tujia na ye Kwenda minguni Tuache mazoea Tukia mka Salamba Tuache mazoea Tukimaliza siku salamba Dunia ni tunapita Tua safiri Umeji ya naje Na safari Halikuwa na sejana Ayupo Siku zako zina karibia kwisha Siku zako zime sabiwa nuku ya Kila siku, siku yako ya kufa ina karibia Kila siku unasongea kaburini 
kila siku unasongea kaburini hakikisha kwamba umepanga maisha yako Jamani wenzangu maisha yetu yako mikononi mwa Mungu. Unapoamka salama kumbuka tu kumwambia ni asante. Unapomaliza siku salama mwambie tu ni asante. Oh, mapi. Hubu duniani sio kwetu tu wasafiri. Hubu duniani sio kwetu tunasafiri. Moja baada ya mwingi Tunasafiri Tunaelekea mbinguni Kwenye maisha ya milele Tuache dunia hii Ya maanga hiko Tuache dunia hii Ya kumiza moyo Tuache dunia hii Yenye kilio Tuache dunia Yenye magonjwa Halikuwa na sijana Leo ayuko Imipango ya mungu Haipanguki Tumo safarini Halikuwa na sijana Sikitisha Boyo Hewe kifo Kutujibu Bona Unachukua Mpaka wale Wanamtumikia mungu Hili niswali Ninani umiza Boyo Hili niswali Nimeri waza Kumbe Tuko safari ni sisi Kumbe Tunapita Alikuwa na sejana Leo ayupo Tunaomboleza Nimipango ya mungu Nafasi ndiyo hitu na hai Kesho yetu wakuna na ye ijua Siku za koduniani Zina karibia kusha Ya tupasa Tujia na ye Na yo safari Ya tupasa Tujia na ye Kwenda minguni Tuache mazoea Tukia mka Salamba Tuache mazoea Tukimaliza siku salamba Dunia ni tunapita Tua safiri Umeji ya naje Na safari Halikuwa na sejana Ayupo Siku zako zina karibia kwisha Siku zako zime sabiwa dugu ya Kila siku, siku yako ya kufa ina karibia Kila siku zako duniani zimesabi wa nuguya Kila siku zako duniani zimesabi wa nuguya
kila siku unasongea kaburini hakikisha kwamba umepanga maisha yako Jamani wenzangu maisha yetu yako mikononi mwa Mungu. Unapoamka salama kumbuka tu kumwambia ni asante. Unapomaliza siku salama mwambie tu ni asante. Oh, mapi. Hubu duniani sio kwetu tu wasafiri. Hubu duniani sio kwetu tunasafiri. Moja baada ya mwingi Tunasafiri Tunaelekea mbinguni kwenye maisha ya milele Tuache dunia hii ya mahangaiko Tuache dunia hii ya kuumiza moyo Tuache dunia hii Yenye kilio Tuache dunia Yenye magonjwa Alikuwa na sijana Leo ayuko Nimipango ya mungu Haipanguki Tubo safari ni Alikuwa na sijana Sikitisha Boyo Hewe kifo Utujibu Bona Unachukua Mpaka wale Wanamtumikia mungu Hili ni swali Ninani umiza Boyo Hili ni swali Neri waza Kumbe Tuko safari ni sisi Kumbe Tunapita Alikuwa na sejana Leo ayumbo Tunaomboleza Nimipango ya mbo Nafasi ndiyo hitu na hai Kesho yetu wakuna na ye ijua Siku za koduniani Zina karibia kusha Ya tupasa Tujia na ye Na yo safari Ya tupasa Tujia na ye Kwenda minguni Tuache mazoea Tukia mka Salamba Tuache mazoea Tukimaliza siku salamba Tunia ni tunapita Tua safiri Imeji ya naje Na safari Halikuwa na sejana Ayupo Siku zako zina karibia kwisha Siku zako zime sabiwa dugu ya Kila siku, siku yako ya kufa ina karibia
Tunaomba ujasiri katika jina la Yesu na tunaomba neno lako likaweze kutimia maishani mwetu Mungu. Watu wako Bwana. Na ni katika jina la Yesu Mungu wetu tuomba na kuamini. anawapenda sana Mungu anjawatenga upendo wa Mungu upo na Mungu anawapenda sana familia karibu ingawa amani imewafungukia furaha imewafungukia kwa sababu ya kuachwa upendo wa Mungu haufungui Yesu hapa pamoja na nyinyi wapenda zaidi zaidi Aishi katika ulimwengu wa matatizo janga shida kilio na maumivu lakini tuko na tumaini katika Kristo There is hope in Christ Neno la Mungu katika kitabu cha Wakorintho wa 2 kifungu cha tano Tari wa kwanza neno linasema hivi ilio ya dunia hii ikiharibiwa inalo jengo litokalo kwa Mungu nyumba isiyofanywa kwa mikono ilio ya milele mbinguni maana katika nyumba hii kwa ugua tukitamani sana kufika e, kufikwa kao letu litokalo mbinguni ikiwa tukiisha kufika na e, kufikwa Atu taonekana tuhuti. Kani siki hapo kwa hiyo neno. Kuna tumaini katika neno la mungu. Katika maskani hii neno la mungu ni natuambia ya kwamba. Kuna matatizo mengi. Kuna ofu. Kuna mashaka na kuna shida nyingi sana. Tukianza kuwesabu shida ambazo tunapitia katika ulimwengu. Ni nyingi. Hata kila mtu wapewe karatasi ya anze kuandika. Kuna kiri. Ni nyingi. Lakini kuna siku moja tu itafika ambayo tutaacha huu ulimwengu twende tukaishi milele kwa maana tumeaidiwa makao ya milele ambayo hayana shida na hayana mashaka makao haya Yesu ametuambia katika kitabu cha Yohana 14 alienda kututengenezea makao na akikamilisha hayo makao atakuja atatutia sisi twende tukaishi mahali ambapo hakuna shida hakuna maumivu hakuna kilio. Kwa hivyo wapendwa, tuje ya kwamba hata kama mashaka yako yataisha tu. Kwa maana neno la Mungu linaongea ukweli na Yesu anaongea ukweli. Marafiki zetu wanatuacha, ndugu zetu wanatuacha, wazazi wetu wameacha watu wao, lakini tueni ya kwamba hawajapotea. Kuna makao ambayo yanatengenezwa na ambayo tutaishi milele tutakuwa na furaha hakutakuwa na kilio hakutakuwa na shida makao ya milele na mili hii itabadilishwa hii ambayo tuko nayo tutavikwa mili ambayo haina maumivu na tutaishi kwa furaha milele na milele kwa hivyo bwana atufariki kwa hayo maneno machache Mungu atutie nguvu wakati huu ambao ni mgumu kweli kwa familia marafiki na kanisa Mungu atutie nguvu sana ili tukifanya kazi tuje ya kwamba tumeaidiwa tuweke tuweke tumaini tuje ya kwamba Mungu ametuahidi na ametuahidi kweli kwa hivyo nataka nipe mchungaji mwenzangu tena aombe na niwaambie ni kitu kimebaki kidogo alafu tumalizie Bwana ambao ni mkono wenye nguvu na hii Bwana ambao ni mkono wenye nguvu na ili tukaishi uwepo wako wakati kama huu na ni katika jina la Yesu mfalme wetu tumeomba na kuamini amen inajua wakati inaenda sana kabla ni hatia kiki kwa leo ndogo tuko na wachungaji hapa na ni vyema ili wakuja tu wamoja hapa tu waonekane waonekane wasalimiane kidogo hawatasoma mistari because of time factor na ndio tupatie mistari si na basi na ndio kabla hawajafika hapa mbele Tuko na mnenaji wa siku ya leo, 
katika main arena chaplain namba wasa wachungaji watatu hawakinadala Yes, I see you. I see you. I Yes, <laughs> Asali sana mchungaji Firstly, I want to comment the Kilaj The pastors who are here in great numbers The wife of the late Ruth is with us here And the other mourners who are here together with the family people I want to take this opportunity to say The longest journey begins with the first step We have walked several steps and we are almost towards to the end of the What we have been arranging is my humble time to ask everybody here to relax because we must accomplish what is ahead of us today. Kwa hivyo tutaanza safari hapa sasa kutoa na hapi sasa wa police they will do most of the work because they are the form there and they, they will have other duties to perform with the police. Kwa hivyo tukitoka hapa for sure I do not know how many vehicles we have. The vehicles that I can command are two because we can the others are around here. The one for the police is there. Wale 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 may not have a room to be pressed. Kwa hivyo tukifika pale, ngari ambayo itaingia ni Asfan, ngari ya Meja, na kuna ngari ingini na watu wajamia ambako kuna mwoma pale ndani. Kwa hivyo, when we go up, ukionyesho maani wa kuweka ngari, don't force yourself inside because if you force it out, I will compel you to use it. Kwa shima zote. Kwa sababu hiyo, nganitaka wale ambayo, wale ambayo walikuwa kwa hii ngari waingie, wale wengine kwa hile kwa ngari ya mbatu tuka nae mulemani wa ingie alafu wale wengine muingie kwa ngari hile muna yuwa mutaingia zani yaki ona ngari hata pia hiyo ngari ya polisa mbayo kuna nakikuwa the speaker of the day here that kwa hivyo kifika pali juu don't make a mistake kwa mando kifana mistake mimi siyu ya ibu Aibu ndiwe takuwa na woka mani ita announce uyu mutu is going against the wish of the committee. Kwa hivyo, kila mungu wangari ambayo, unetanya yungi sasa.
Mimi na uba Oh Ile na loli na sikitisha Boyo Hey wake for utujibu Bona unachukua mpaka wale wanamtumikia Mungu Ile ni swali ndani umeza moyo Ile ni swali ndani waza Safari ni sisi Kube Tunapita Alikuwa na sejanda Leo ayumbo Tunaoboleza Ini pango ya mungu Haipanguki Alikuwa na sejanda Nafasi ndiyo hitu na hai Kesho yetu wakuna na ye ijua Siku za kodu ni ani Zina karibia kusha Ya tupasa Tujia ndahe Na yo safari Ya tupasa Tujia ndahe Kwenda minguni Tuache mazoea Tukia mka Salamba Tuache mazoea Tukimaliza siku salamba Dunia ni tunapita Tuwa safiri Umeji ya naje Na safari Halikuwa na sejanda Ayupo Siku zako zina karibia kwisha Siku zako zimesabiwa dugu ya Kila siku, siku yako ya kufa ina karibia Karibia kwisha Siku zako zimesabiwa dugu ya Kila siku Siku yako ya kufa ina karibia Haipanguki Halikuwa na sijana Duniani zimesami wa nugu ya Kila siku unasongea kamuini Hakikisha kwa mbome panga maisha yako Jamani wenzangu maisha yetu ya komikono ni mwamungu Unapo wabuka salama, kumbuka tuku muambia ni asande Unapo maliza siku salama, muambia tu ni asande Humu duniani, siya wetu, tuwa safiri Humu duniani, siya wetu, tuna safiri Moja bada ya mwingine, tuna safiri Naelekea mbinguni Kwenye maisha ya milele Tuwache dunia hii Ya manga hiko Tuwache dunia hii Ya kumiza moyo Tuwache dunia hii Yenye kilio Tuwache dunia hii 
yenye magonjwa alikuwa na sijana Mazoea tukimaliza siku salama Dunia ni tunapita tuwasafiri Umeji andaje na safari oh, Alikuwa na sijana ayupo Zinakaribia kuisha Siku zako zimesabiwa dugu ya Kila siku Siku yako ya kufa inakaribia Zimesabiwa dugu ya Kila siku unasongea kamulini Hakikisha kwa mbubo panga maisha yako Jamani wenzangu Maisha yetu ya komikono ni mwamungu Unapo wabuka salama, kumbuka tuku muambia ni asande Unapo maliza siku salama, muambia tu ni asande Humu duniani, siya wetu, tuwa safiri Humu duniani, siya wetu, tuna safiri Moja bada ya mwingine, tuna safiri Naelekea mbinguni Kwenye maisha ya milele Tuwache dunia hii Ya maanga hiko Tuwache dunia hii Ya kuumiza moyo Tuwache dunia hii Yenye kilio Tuwache dunia hii 
Yenye magonjwa Alikuwa na sijana Mazoea tukimaliza siku salama Dunia ni tunapita tuwasafiri Imeji andaje na safari oh, Alikuwa na sijana ayupo
yenye magonjwa alikuwa na sijana Safiri Umeji andaje Na safari Halikuwa na sejana Hayupo Leo hayupo Tunamu omboleza Hini pango ya mungu Tuji andaje Haipanguki Siku zako zinakaribia kwisha Halikuwa na sejana Siku zako zimesabiwa dugu ya Leo Siku, siku yako ya kufa inakaribia Haipanguki Halikuwa na sijana Nizimesamiwa nugu yangu Kila siku unasongea kaburini Hakikisha kwa mbome panda maisha yako Jamani wenzangu Maisha yetu yako mikononi mwa mungu Unapo wabuka salama, kumbuka tuku muambia ni asande Unapo maliza siku salama, muambia tu ni asande Humu duniani, siya wetu, tuwa safiri Humu duniani, siya wetu, tuna safiri Moja bada ya mwingine, tuna safiri Naelekea mbinguni Kwenye maisha ya milele Tuwache dunia hii Ya maanga hiko Tuwache dunia hii Ya kuumiza moyo Tuwache dunia hii Yenye kilio Tuwache dunia hii 
yenye magonjwa alikuwa na sijana
Asante kwa siku jema bwana ambayo umetupa. Tazama tuko katika hii boma bwana. Tukiwa tayari bwana kwanza ibada yetu ya kumsindikisha ndugu yetu. Tunajiweka mikononi mwako bwana na ibada yote bwana tuiweka mikononi mwako. Na bwana wacha faraja zako bwana zikawe kwa watu wa boma hii na ukawapatie nguvu na ujasiri ili wakaweze kufumilia. Tukijua bwana lazima mazito yatatupata tukiwa kwenye dunia hii. Na bwana tutakapoona mwisho wa ibada tutakushukuru. Uinuliwe na uimindiwe. Na ni katika jina la bwana wetu Yesu Kristo tumeomba. Amen. Amen. Basi tunaweza keti sehemu ni kidogo lakini kuna zile sehemu zimetengwa kwa nyimboma wako hapa na kama kuna wale wa wadla yatosoe hapa wataenda kando ya maafisa wetu pande ile ya mkono wa kushoto nimeambiwa kwamba yeye si dhome kwa yeye wamekuja watapatiwa nafasi waone wataketi wapi kwa sasa ni niwalike wa, ni wa, ni waimbaji kutoka yeye si msakwani wa mtukuze Mungu wa ngo mmoja Karibu kiongozi wetu wa ratiba ya leo Pipi Kilu Please for the pastors Pastor Kalandi that be pastor song etina Tani yimu me papasta Songa yetina tafadhali Maisha ubi ndo kondunge we will start when we are settled very good let us comply tutulie ili tuanze mambo vizuri kama wewe wa huyu huyu pastor tafadhali songa nyuma so that we please we we, we create room for the pastors watu wa jamii wameketi kwa hivyo misapira kuna kitu ulikuwa umesema ulikuwa umesema nini endelea kwaya kwaya msa kwani one presentation Badae dhome kama wako tayari Kwa ya wame sakuwa ni wame ina kuina Nikana uze kuithi ya baba wakiendelea na kuimba Unaiwa maali chakula kimepango hapa ni panaitaji pia watu wawa wameka Kwa hivo wakimadeza uwa uimbo Tutahenda wakipili cha maakuli ili tukule Watu wapata nafasi ya mambo yale mengine wakeimba tuyambia ula na tuyambia ula ona vuku mmanga hii anumaa musie diese madam ujuu wajuse yaani i think you are ready mami na kupa bawe tu kuriete mwana wa anumaa musie maimose liwoza liwu uisho kapala we hili ukichukua chakula daruti maali ulekua na kusiwe mtu asimama kachukue chakula uchukue nafasi yake kwa maana ukifanya hivyo itakuaibisha <laughs> basi kabla kwa kabla kwaya waanze kumtukuza Mungu kwa wimbo ningalitaka niombe mmoja wetu atuongoze kwa mahombi kwa ajili ya chakula nani yule Yosipi yuko wapi hapana yule pasa kutoka Manza yuko wapi tome sorry tuamini pamoja Mungu wetu na baba yetu tunakutumaini wakati kama huu maana tunajua wakati wowote unakuwa pamoja nasi. Tunakushukuru kwa kutuleta na tunapoanza ibada hii tumekushukuru. Tunaendelea kukushukuru kwa maana tunajua utakuwa pamoja nasi. Umefika wakati wa mankuli na tunaomba ili kwa sakula Mwenyezi Mungu ukitakaze na ukibariki kwa ajili ya mili yetu. Kupitia kwa Yesu Kristo tunaomba na kuamini. Amen. Amen. Tunaanza na watumishi wa Mungu uh, watu wa jamii alafu maafisa wa polisi wafuate tukimaliza nitasema wale wengine watafata kwa hivyo kilaji pasta reference nyote kama unatumikia una Mungu na una, neno la Mungu tangulia kwa chakula it's no time wasting now reference mwenye Watendi hiu wale Alafu pisa pisa honda na wawo Pisa pisa ni wapi
Asante. Watu wa jamii wafuate vekiraji alafu police officers nao pia wa, wa, waende chakula. Wana wazee wazee wakiletewa chakula mahali wanakaa itakuwa vizuri. Eh si leo mnani mtukue nafasi. Watu wa jamii nikisungumzia jamii hata Titus family ni watu wa jamii waendee chakula. Titus family ni watu wa jamii na wao wengine. Bome one number tafadhali. As much as we would have liked to have two serving points, the space is inadequate, therefore, serving point in Moja. Lakina mutu atapata chakula kwa maana chakula kiku cha kutosha. Okay, let me move it. Yani mwenye ngari KD, anafungia ngari ya polisi ku wenda so remove it from the road. You wish it.
The instructions that we have from another corner is that whoever is here should eat. Kuna wale wameingia sasa hivi people like Motaba, Kenton na wengine. I do not know if I have met. I have met wa mulu. Meta wa mulu ngama. Ruiza ende abani, ruiza ende abani ngutume. Munga to me, I know you cannot let me down. Yes. 
Asante. You need me transferred from that place to another one court because when it is there, it is proving dangerous. Wajuzi na kuomba utupe mkono kama vile Mambo Hey, I see Mr. Kwan, it's a Vadali. What you see, Mr. Kwan, the Mepin with the son of Uvo, I could Thank you. 
Wajusi restaurant and your staff. If these eating utensils can be removed now, the program can officially kick off. Let us not call it that is mixed activities. Na wao imbaji ambao mnaona mbele yenu wanakanda ambao wanauza kwa bei mzuri. good songs. So if you wish to buy one from them consult with the them. Wajuzi tamadhali toa hii Toa hii kireta mbaiko kuna mali hapa Kiki katika ni wani kutuwa kumisi ya nubetanga hii Eza katika ni wajibe matuwa Kana kireti kana saani siku majukite mbe Saani ambazo siku katika tewe Katika tewe siku ma Ya songe mbe
Basi, anu matayenga ine zawe anu uwe Ate ondo maki, ima mataku, matama And we appreciate the choir Asanda choir Basi Tereza leo Nishere ambazo Watu wengi wame kusanyika Kwa hivyo I am forced by circumstances to nikitumia kikamba kidogo na kizuri kidogo tutakubaliana lakini most of the time I'll be using kikamba kwa maana wanaswahili wanasema wengi wa if I speak a lot of kikamba what is supposed to be known by those who can never follow kikamba I will be able to inject it politely kwa sababu hiyo I would wish everybody now to settle kila mtu wa the program can kick off officially together with me is Mr. Jackson Mr. Jackson if you can come here we are the programmers kwanza ni kwamba mtu mama mbele wa, wa, ya watu huwa anawasalimia eti kilisito ni Yesu mweaseo misha pita kenyu ndu the thing i have done bwana asifiwe na mimi si jambo to call upon the host a man from the family to give us a word of welcome koti ni mtu anasimama patia mike uru wa yesu wa milele amjambo masters of ceremony the clergy, Kenya Police Service, Deputy Count Commander, Mr. Musimi, Police Officer, Police Officers present, Gini Tuko Hapa, Mmeambiwa Jinalangu, 
na kwa niaba ya familia who is uh, Daniel Manvis uh, father na wakaribisha nyote katika mbayo ni ibada ya mwisho ya Maikasin Daniel kwa ulimwengu huu tuko na Mungu na Mungu amekuwa nasi tangu tuanze hii safari na mko na sisi hapa na shukuru nyinyi kwa kuja kutufariji file tom welcome na tuwe pamoja sana asante sana mwenye mboma wakati huu been welcomed i would wish to call the pastor eh, i see mr kwani but let me change slightly let me call upon bishop kababu to lead us with a word of opening prayer naomba tunyanyuke simama mali ulipo Baba katika jina la Yesu Kristo tuna kila sababu za kutukuza na kulihimidi na kulienzi jina lako majira haya mchana wa leo kwa sababu ya jambo wewe ulilolisema alinabudi kutokea lakini lipo neno umeliangia juu yetu ya kwamba tunaweza kufarijiana na sisi ni wapitaji katika ibada hii tunapenda kukualika ili wingu la utukufu wako likapate kushuka na kutanda juu yetu na ukapate kuhudumia nafsi zetu. Tupe faraja ambazo zilizungumzwa na mtumishi wako Paulo katika kitabu cha Wakorinto ya kwamba Roho Mtakatifu anapeana faraja. Na mtumishi wako Isaia akasema farijini farijini watu wangu asema Bwana. Inaelekea ulielewa ya kwamba upo uchungu unaoambatana na kuachwa na wapendwa wetu. Na kwa hivyo ulichomaanisha uliposema farijini tunaomba kwa jina la Yesu Kristo kikapate katika moja wetu ili tukapate kutulia tu. zisha na kuingoa katika jina la Yesu Kristo na kila mamlaka ambayo inaweka za kuinuka kinyume nasi tunapenda kuingoa na tunatangaza sawa neno lako uliposema katika kitabu cha Isaia tuambie wenye haki itakuwaheri tunaomba hiwe hivyo na ratiba baba ukapate kuitangulia na tukifika tamati tutamakinika kulitukuza na kulimidi jina lako asante kwa kusikia maombi yetu kwa maana katika jina la Yesu Kristo aliye bwana mkubwa wetu tumeomba Asante Bishop. Teachers teach from known to unknown. And at this time I want to come to known. Ningalitaka mwendwa akadibie mahali hapa ili apate kutusomea maisha ya mwenda zake. Let us hear the eulogy of the late Daniel. Mazuri kukupale. Niyomba ni wasalimu katika jina la Yesu Bwana Yesu asiwe. Amen. Tuende pamoja kusoma eulogy. Tuanze. Early life. Daniel Mandi Makau was born in on 10th 9th 1963 at Misakwani village Machakos district. He was the eldest son of late Jeremiah Makau Mudempa and Pastor Lady Beth Mbida Makau. He His siblings are Alice Mukui Moya and Elijah Mwani Makau. As a young boy, Mand lived with his parents and siblings at their home. Having been born 
in a God fearing Christian home, he was dedicated and baptized at AS in Sakwani Church. In January 1973, he joined Chambuko Primary School, where he successfully completed his primary school. He passed his Certificate of Primary Education, CPE, in 1979. In 1980, Manti joined Pomponi High School, where he was active in athletics. He successfully completed his high school education and sat for his all levels national examination in 1983. Meanwhile, he has been participating as a member of the Christian Youth in Action, the Christian Service Battalion, and the Misakwani AAC Church Choir. Man loved singing and listening to Tanzanian gospel choirs. Career right. Man, Manthi's dream was to become a policeman and in 1987 God opened an opportunity for him at the General Service Unit GSU. He successfully completed his training and earned his pass out parade in 1988. He was post posted at Empakasi, Nairobi where he served for a few years then transferred to the north, northeastern Kenya. Manthi felt his mission with the GSU and accom accomplished, accomplished and so he moved on to join the Kenya Police Force General Duty. He has served in Embu Provincial Headquarters, Maria Manthi, Water, and finally Machakos where he has been working until last year when his health started deteriorating. Family life. In 1981, 1991, Manthi met and married Elysia Kaleche, whom he shared two sons, Peter Motuku and Banabas Man Makao Manthi. In 2002, he was blessed and met. He, he, he was blessed to meet and marry Ruth Nzemi, with whom he shared two daughters, Charity Motuku and Immaculate Peter Manthi. Illness and demise. Manthi and lived a healthy life all his life. His hospitalization. In November 2021 at Shalom Hospital Machakos came as a surprise. He truly and socially put up a good health. He was blessed to be surrounded in prayer by the church, family and friends. He was also in the hands of me good medical team where, where, who were with great encouragement to him and his family who visited him whenever he was hospitalized. After a few weeks, he was well enough to be his chance and go back home to his family. He was also able to report back to work and he adopted he would retire in service. In July 2022, he was hospitalized again during this time and become more venerable. He said he was declining fast, but he knew in the power of the healing that he needed was only found in God. He personally requested his brother Elijah to pray for him. Prevent prayers were constantly meant for him during this time. In early August 2022, for the third time, he was admitted to the hospital in a very critical condition. As the medical team were planning to advance his care to the intensive care unit ICU, he breathed his last round around 1.20 p.m. on Thursday, 8, 20, 20, on Thursday 25th, 8, 2022. He was surrounded by his loving wife, Ruth Nzembi, and other family members. Rest in power, Daniel Mandi Maka. We'll miss you dearly. Asante. Asante. Asante, Benwa. Now you are prongo na miko na watu wengi. I am consulting with the, the person who will speak the word. And he tells me, we may change the program slightly. Kwa hivyo ningalitaka tuingiwa kipindi cha praise and worship aingia love tindu staff wata baadaye. Kwa hivyo ningalitaka niombe the pastors and the choir and the, the church from Thome wakiwa tayari watubatie pambio church ili tuingie kwa praise and worship. Iyo ni kipindi cha Pastors. Ningependa sisote alafu naomba pastor Judy atuongoze kwa hicho kipindi. 
na tafadhali za simama simama tafadhali piga makofi ainuliwe bwana wa mabwana ainuliwe ambe ame Bwana wa mabwana ainuliwe ambe tenda ame ainuliwe bwana wa mabwana ainuliwe ambe tenda ame ma bwana wa mabwana ainuliwe ambe tenda ame ainuliwe bwana wa madeshi yesu
tuombe pamoja nasi Tuendelee kuombea ili Mwenyezi Mungu awafariji Tuombe hata kwa ajili ya neno lake Andae nafasi njema katika mioyo yetu Na mioyo yetu ikubali neno la Mungu na ipokee neno la Mungu ambao umetuleta ili tusikie neno lako. Ndio bwana. Tunajua kuna wengi wako na shughuli zao tofauti na watapata nafasi ya kusikia kutoka kwako. Ndio bwana. Tunakushukuru maana sisi tutatulia mbele zako na wewe utanena nasi kupitia mtumishi wako. Ndio bwana. Tunampeana mikononi mwako ili Mwenyezi Mungu uzungumze naye, naye alilete neno lake lako vile umeandaa siku ya leo. Ndiyo tunaomba utusaidie, tunaomba usimame pamoja nasi. Tuonapo mwisho Mwenyezi Mungu tuta kushukuru Ndiyo na ni katika zina la Yesu tunaomba na kuamini. Amen. Kila mtu apigie bwana makofi. Asanteni. Eh. Sasa ninakutaja on further consultation with the police officers. Nimeambia kibidi cha leo kisa kuko etinanga. Tiki katika tributes Potos na Reds Kuhuni nda ukulia Ame kakavari Ame ukona bisa Patu mika na Isa andi kumi ngamitu Kati ye the right position If you want it to be rearranged We are ready to do so Nipendule Police
Kwa sababu kuna watumishi kutoka pande za wengine eh usiwe katelembo kwa wili make sure that those pastors are seated Kondisheni mali wanaweza kukaa unaweza kuwaleta upande huu Kondisheni alitu kuna viti I think now the the casket is in its good position. Naningalitaka wanda la kipinja tributes maua na potos kawaida let me consult with the mayor ni sawa sawa sasa kawaida amari ya demand anapewa maua ya natangulishwa na bibi zake you all know that not you all know some of us know that Mandi was a polygamist. He had two wives, Tresia Kaleche and the Ruth in Zembi. Lakila mtu alikuwa anaishi kivyake. Lakini wote ni wa Mandi. Kwa hivyo nikalitaka ni seme hivi. Mauwa kila mtu atapeana, akiwa peke yake vile wanaishi. Kwa hivyo wana kwanza nilakua ya bibi yake yule mkubwa, Tresia Kaleche. Aje, apeane huwa. Then she is accompanied by her sons. Ambaye, one of them, Banabas Makao Arasoma, tribute here. Makao Yukapo, he is just standing next to you. Tribute to Nona Zimanda Wapi. Nona Anna Apa. Yes. Mrs. Simonulu. Mrs. Simaka Muyapa. You are the floral matrons. Stand behind the casket, please. Then in Meita, they are there. Mrs. Simwaka, Mrs. Simululu. The, the ones which are behind can be moved slightly. Jackson. numbers makao unaweza kusoma tribute ya mamako mpatie kipasa sauti this what i do amen this is a tribute from wife teresia kaleche also my mom i met daniel mandi makao and got married under customer row in the year 
who were blessed with two boys, Peter Mutukumandi and Barnabas Makaumandi. My children, and I thank God for the time he allowed Mandi to be with us. May God rest his soul in eternal peace. Amen. Thank you. Asante. Mwenye kusoma tribute mtoto wake Mandi. Asante. Tribute ambayo tafuata sasa ni ya yule bibi mwingine Ruth Nzembi ambaye yuko hapa. Nzembi Ruth if you can pay the rent and give your tribute. Pay us TV yake. Na yake pia ita ni ya kusoma na Samuel Mwendo ndugu yake ya watamsomea. Tribute from Rwai Ruth Nzembi. That's my older sister. My husband was such a wonderful man. I'm not sure I can really express just how I will miss him. Not only was he a wonderful husband, but a wonderful father, best friend, colleague, and so much more. Daniel's ability to make everyone feel comfortable, secure, and loved was his greatest strength. He was my soulmate and my inspiration, my steadfast rock that helped me through thick and thin. Daniel supported and loved us all, and I was always there to help navigate through life's challenges. Daniel may be in heaven now, but I know he's looking down at us with a big smile on his face saying, Fold your head, make the best of life, and I will see you soon. We have, we have work to do up here too. Goodbye, my dear sweet husband, and God bless you. I love Asante. Ile ingini tafuata. Charity. Mutio. Usonge mbele. Mwani kitoko nyo. And one of you can read because I know it is written. One of you can read. Dad was not a man of many words. He was calm, gentle, observant, liked keeping to himself and funny in his own way. He, al he also cherished his nail cutter and kept it close to him because he loved keeping his fingernails short. Dad tried hard to make us happy, to make sure we had everything we needed, and he was always asking if he had anything troubling us. He said that he would never let us have problems when he was there. He was a giver, always trying to make us comfortable and to make us laugh. Dad was not the kind of person that goes out of their way to step on people's toes. Instead, He was a man that allowed us to grow, flourish, and to become our best selves. He never interfered. He let us be and guided us from the sidelines, holding our hands. Dad, as you say our last goodbye, tears rolled down our cheeks. We had great times when they lasted. We had joy. We had fun. We had many little moments. And we had seasons in the sky. We made memories. And we had our fights too. Every second we spent together became a part of us. You showed us life from different perspectives. You have left us with priceless lessons that will guide us through life. We wouldn't be the people we are today if not for you. And for that, we are internally grateful. We could share a lot about the kind of person you are, but no amount of words would ever express what you want to. Our souls ache, our spirits hurt, and our hearts are still in many broken pieces. Thank you.
you're trying to put back together. Papa, fare thee well until we meet again. May you dance with the angels. May the good Lord take away your pain. May you shine on. You are gone, but you will never be forgotten. Goodbye for now, our Father. Asante, let us hear from the sons, still standing there, those who are able to, to stand. Nisao. Ilala yikingiji kuatia ni yaesu kuwe, grandchildren. Grandchildren, I'm told, they are grandchildren. Stand in front of the casket. Asante. Hiyo ingine linafuata sasa ni la mzazi mtumishi wa Mungu Pastor Mbedhi ambaye Karenji asli aliniambia yake atasungumza. Ali, alisema azungumze ni ukewa kando. Kwa hivyo I stand just beside her. If she will leave something behind I will inject it. Those are words from her mouth. Mama nili kamotesia Ika mama wake mama tuweke Mato pato wa haima Ona ona tatu matatu nosu Nusi musiwe mama tatu na mami Kuhu unga mete Unga mete ni mami Na kuhu ya utewe na ngobia ni mwaitu Na kuhu nusu unge ni mama Three sisters in law who love each other dearly. And was Matua and Zaka the Missilengi don't know who emulate the way those three women live to be a blessing to the to many families. Those women really hardly disagree on issues. My Aneoki passes out. Nunga me it over. Munenge nukunena na ambiji nukunena Nukunenge mbezi ya na ambiji nukunena Munenge mami Kakaji mkeze nyo Mbezi kanya yesu mwaseo Ete yesu Ya laba mwote laki kamba nata binulo Nginu kundu wa shikuna Amisema amujambu nyote Na nasema kama muna mwe ya sikiki kamba atafusiwa na mwazaki Aaaa Kini kutunda nga ima vya mungu wako vika kwe mungu kuka mdeze shakuma shamana uwa kwa Uwa kwa mungu Kini kutunda nga ima vya mungu wako kuka mdeze shanono njio andeno tuende te Oon tuende me Tua wangu na tuwe na ajali na kila kengi kiuka Nga ina kumbo wa ya nika nani vena uomi isha Nene mutoko miwangai ulane tabashadu alama kwe wanga meo mese ina mimo noki ya mwanda vya no mese na nende na kumese ya mina vina na rupa iwa mani 
Asante. Vile amesungumusa nikiongezea ni taarifa. Asante. Asante mami. Hizo longi ni laje kuatia ni ya ya ikinywa mabututia na muume mmo na brothers brothers and sisters and their spouses that one is led by is is Alice Mukui Simon is the husband to Mukui Okay. Napenda kuchukua nafasi hii ili kumshukuru Mwenyezi Mungu. Ah nikisimama hapa mimi naitwa Simon Mwia Mutwa na ninaye simama naye hapa ni bibi yangu ama mama Mwendwa naitwa Alice Mukui. Ameandika a, ameandika yake mimi nitazungumza. Kwa hivyo nitasoma yake kwanza alafu nitazungumza kidogo. Ah tribute from sister Alice Mukui. Monthly you went away so suddenly. We did not say goodbye, but brother Ningependa kuongeza kidogo uh, kusema kwamba tangu tangu nilioa kutoka nyumba ya Jeremia uh, miaka 30 iliyopita tumeishi vema na familia yote uh, pamoja na brother in law uh, Daniel Mandi. Uh, tulishirikiana kwa mambo yote na tulipendana na hadi mwisho wakati alikuwa hospitali tuliongea mambo mengi na ninashukuru Mungu kwa sababu ameweka ameweka uh, siku za kila mtu na mahali ameweka mstari hakuna yeyote ambaye anaweza kupita kwa hivyo tunashukuru Mungu na tunaomba mtuombe asanteni sana asante yani pamoja na hiyo tukiwa hapa Ingalitaka muelewe ya kwamba whatever is happening here is also being seen in abroad countries. Therefore, I am instructed by Elia Mandhi to allow him speak as you people listen. Welcome Elia. At one time he told me not to crack many jokes because people in Ambroda are viewing.
Hello. Can you hear us? Hello. Hello, my name is Kia. Love the wife. Only that the sound has not reached us. Kuna chombo kimoja kiko chini. Hello. Wana saideana. Wana sifiwe. The great hope to be successful. Tulieni ni mambo wa technology.
Thomas mm. to endele. Otherwise, just oh, we were. Vika kwa monsumbe toka inana toka ina toka toka ina twa vika twa vika moshi kwake toka mota yawe toka ina na moyo twa vika twa vika Ande wa Yesu Toka inana laika Toi mokata mosumbe Hanedo Haleluya Haleluya Tonga ne Tembe wa We Yesu We Yesu Tunga metuge kota Wamitano Toka ina toka Toka ina toka One nga evina waku One nga evina waku E na na siena ku Na no chonde Kedele Twa vika Twa vika Mewa ye Toka ina na laika Toi moka na mosume Halelu Halelu ya halelu ya Toga ne teme Mwa twa vika Twa vika Ame wa yeneso Toka ina na laika Toi mokata mosume Haleno Haleluya Haleluya Tonga me Tebe wa Tua vika kwa mosume Tua vika kwa mosume Toka inana laika Toka ima Toka ina toka ina Toa vika mosye kwa te Toka mota yawe Toka ina na moyo Toa vika toa vika Mewa ye so Toka ina na laika Toi moka na mosume Haleno Uya haleno Uya Toka me Tembe wake Toa vika Toa vika Mewa ye So Toka ina na laika Toi moka Sunde, Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Tonga me, tebe wake. Eti kili, eti kili, ne mo endwa ma ke. 
Akamweta kila mondo na shetwa Etikili, etikili, etikili Nimoe dwama ake Akamweta kila mondo na shetwa Makatisa tandata sheko ya itune Makadea taia nobe uoake Yesu oka Yesu oka ewe mwene kumo Ninguasa <laughs> I want to thank you all that you came. I want to thank God, first of all, that he has granted us this opportunity to come and bid farewell to my brother. Uh, briefly, let me say what I know about my brother. Mutabiondo nyesi mandi. Mandi mokoa. Na niwane mili. Messi lama kwa my first memories of mandi. Mandi ni wawai physical therapist wako wambe Physical therapist kumani chani wawai mbundi ya sakuti Nungu na asei wandai na mauma seo Na nene kiwa ya tu siya Siya hili wa uka Siya hili wa uundu Na mandi na mkua Alice mkui Ni mwama Ma nengi wa kibalua cha kila mwada na Makandi uka siya nomba Nza wa nomba Round 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 As that my feet and learn to walk with those shoes. I, I thank God because of that. I could not be walking today. I could not be walking today. I could not be walking today. I could not I protective. Chambuko primary school, Mandi, I already had Chambuko. Na, nundu nje, 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 o Mandi, I, o enoka, na, kwa kila vinda, a, a, kwa nundu nje, 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 na, I could not walk fast, and Mandi, who used to walk with me, every day, and the nukete, the nukete, yungwe, na, Mandi, adi, adi, ka, Mumboni High School Na mandi asoma mumboni 
na ami na mbuni na 1987 mandi alika GSU ili arena mbuni alika GSU ni nona mandi ajina kwaya ee si misa kwani ajina kwaya ee battalion and COIA I used to see all that na mandi alika GSU tu adituona mandi adraduate pasa utiparede ya kwa ya kwa ya mbe kwa tendi na minyonye kwa mandi ya mbakasi na di 1988 nena my dad kwa hindi ya mbakasi kwa kituona man a graduate as a GSC officer na man di a post wa mbakasi na kwa ibinda yu na inanali kama na nikile na ima chako school na ingu lilika na 1989 ba chako school ba hii mwvila wanda uka wa between ba chako school na chulu na kwa kila kawa imwana na kawuzi wa kima saku and it became a big thing And that time, uh, Mandy was on, on his uh, annual leave, and he came from Machakos. Every every day, I go. Okay, kala tito mono buka Machakos kula to make sure that I was safe. Nelo oki lambona oki ambona mbiane ne ukido isa kana wisa wa na mwe ne sa wa na ingoli di garanti mwe ai. Ito ndo oka e dumbo ya mokate. Mandy ambia ah no no mabaya masakunze mbete. Noko, na njuko kudawa ya mukate aiwe oh kama ndo that was used to t- tell me about and every time to argue like mama dambia no kama ndo and i still remember all those two yana na na di na mimi na machako kuna na nje university of nairobi mandi wa ai embakasi ai you were still in embakasi the mandi there is a way man used to talk uh, and they were direct i eslava yo tela kino kama naongo kwasia But I remember he told me that um when you are the university mwa kwata ila rayo tsenyu dika kwa mane street tini no ndika tiko mane aba ya street tini ukama na baundi brala di brala wako that is another way of telling me just behave yourself be a good student na mandi man 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 i have so many memories cha mandi mandi uh mandi twa di na di some of the high school na Ananda unjebu kama ni wote. Afu. Aiye lokanga kwa kala dakika. Ai. Ya ang. Kafu. Ambia kana nene nene hadi kana kana we look the same. It was put any to you. So everybody in the staff room knew that's well. Na tuadibu tuadibu ambia tu inga odoe na ma tuadibu masai masii soko ni ando ya na ma na tu asio tu tu amina ambi ananda ambia kwa hiyo kitu ambia sio kawiani and that was my brother a very protective man na ningo ndi kana njuka ku na airport pisala ndi kana na ku nitu nake he was holding me by the shoulders to show that he is very protective protective of his little brother and peter ka bro ono mundi ilo na kuna mkunia si mwambia ka bro ka bro ka bro na mandi sometimes we will disagree to agree mundu wa duma negi mabako meko chondo niti wa makongala na siena so we used to disagree but every time we disagreed mandi used to remind me when we see little siani wewe and that used to bring me down na i remember and i remember last year mwaiwa mwaiwa kumi na mwaingo ni asimwambia bro uh, nini wa ye na mboye and i knew at that point man the new his, his strength his source of help was only coming from god not from anything else and i kept on praying for him i gathered my friends to pray for him and we prayed and prayed and prayed but uh, well god had an other plans and i am i am um here sadly bidding farewell to my brother my only brother my protector my hero uh mandi komanesa uh tukona na na ngena mbo mina ningo nda kutunga mvea kwa my family people that took care of mandi rona imo especially his wife ruth ruth you took care of my brother when i was away you cleaned up you you nursed him you you took care of him and i will be i will be forever be indebted to you for taking care of my brother in my absence 
um, thank you for the pastors that have come to pray. Thank you for the entire family. Thank you for my mom, my, my sister Mokui. And uh, I love you and I miss you. God bless you. Thank you. We love you so much that we can burn our houses to buy you an egg. It went there. Elijah Quati, a twin you drink near near Mueva, the Mueva, the Mueva, the Mututia, Nevi, Mueva Simon, Mueva Simon, Song and Bell. Mueva Iba. Mwenendwa ni mwesu kuwe ambedhi ino sini misi isi wake Na ime onenga nela Asante Ila ene ingi ye kuwati ya kanabisa Ni ya kama amusie Na jinenga nwena Ni mwaitu Kana tata mwita hati imwana ni nanzuki na mwono Wata mwita hata tuna haika uu Ena mili kamutesia Aka mwana inya Aka mango osimake Asande misapita No haku Na andi mede meta yari Ana masi ani iwe na Na James Na Yeremia Ono na mwoki. Wila wita yari ya ono masomea. Oh sorry na mbuka wa saimoni nya wa mbuka. Asune yata itina a mwendwe a mwendwe Na mwaka memilika David Seri Nzuki Ruthi Na ala angitha ni metha mokie Matengeba Mambe ya kuungama Mwaito Seri nati ya namona Aiba Songa mbele Niona tababi toki wene Na su yone kusoma na yisoma ni Imo kiwa nzoki Uwe kusoma Vya ngaiba nini? Ya kaini mkaidhe Situa ni ya mwe wa itu Yesu Kristo Njiasi ya mwe ya seo Na uo Wani uwe ukuse wa maanti maa the late Daniel maanti makau Hithi maa nyumbaya Daniel Muthembwa Tuinachewa kinge Nundu wa kutiwa ni mwana wa itu Daniel maanti Anaye mwana wa kwe kwatua Na nuna tuendete muno Tunakoma na ana Ana tuita amwe Tuakoma na ana tuita amwe Anaye vata na itu muno Hivye, tuwewe tuwa asia vanene muno, hindi nundu ngaini we watu nengie mandhi. Na ngai usu, no we unamuosie. Tutunga muwea nundu wa miaka ila, 
tuneka lile na ke ngaya muye usuhuyo ni watene na tene amwendu make Beth, Mary, Seth na Ruth Amen basi hawa tafugatu na cousins cousins ya bata ngozo na Joel Nzuki Mwia cousins ni mwame atia ni moke wakiongozo na Joel Nzuki na wale wengine nimeona major cosmas pia nimemuona nimeona reverend sendrak alex ya mshafika wambua na wale wengine cousins which side sini patano 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 mm. you clarify those are cousins patano side cousins patano side alama nambala ambaa malandi nito nubi tuka cousins b matano alari maa nambala ambaa mosu ni mwe pange nike damo ke ama uma na wasuma like au ndiyo cousins kutoka nyumba moja watoto wa angos wake pia watoto wa ants wake Asante cousins Si kama kuna okay Sasa cousins kutoka upande ule mwingine Matano cousins Wale ni watoto wa dada zake mama Daniel Mandi Tumeona daktari kababu ako pale. Tunaona kina kababu, kina mbaa mosu. Wale wamepotea tafadhali naomba pengine wangoje. Kina daktari, naona kama mmepotea kidogo. Asante ngojeni. Wale cousins Asanti. Sasa wale walikuwa wamepotea walikuwa wameachwa, si kupotea walikuwa tu wameachwa. <laughs> Ni kina cousins, watoto wa aunts wake. Wakiongoza na daktari na muona pale. Ndio hao. Hao mama zao ni dada za Jeremiah Mudhemba. wali sawa ita wa jadani au mama musi au mama musi wakiongozwa na kidhusi chalo kidhusi chalo awaongoze wanaume ama wenye mboma wale wazee wenye mboma wakiongozwa na kidhusi chalo ba, baada yao ni akama musi akama musi hawakuandika jina la ataka, ana musimi ataongoza akama musi Awa ndia aume mamusi Amo kani kwa na mabula nite Ni mabula nite ni saa Musi wa mba amalandi ni mwenene Mba amalandi we ndolo, we kithusi, we We mainge, we muasia Kote ya inge, nati amomo Mayamo wakilisha Meate wani akama amusi Wataka ufukata ni wanawake wa mboma wale ndio ndio kina mama mboma wakiongozwa na Ann Musimi Ann Musimi Ann Musimi na muona Josephine Peter anakuja karibieni pia Biki Dos na muona nakuja na muona Penina mwanzia nakuja ndio anakuja pole pole yule mzee sana ndiye anakuja pole pole anatoka anatoka kwenye njia alikuwa amekaa kwenye kando na tusaomba apatiwe kiti karibu ana musimi aiwe ba kuve
ekaenda na kuuza nzata tatete hotel musini mia nengo kibila pakube amina jafet ya nyaku pakube amina ukangali no maito ukabanga lino no mose ya kibila onaga wazo kini kalile na ekalilo imandi ya kingi ani musimi ukaku ngali na kuku ya yangi maito ni sawa ni sawa ni picha nzuri picha nzuri imechukuliwa au sindi mwa kama musi ndo tumete ainyama ndo ainyama mtutial daniel mandi asanti asanti picha imechukuliwa watakao fuata ni ebwa ebwa mamusi wakiongozwa na Simon Kilonzo ebwa mamusi na atakayeongoza ni mzee Simon Kilonzo Malimu ebwa siana sia e tumaku kwamba malandi ila itongoe ni Simon Kilonzo na alangi rudi anako wapi rudi anakuja Ewa, ewa naona kina mama Lea, mama Karo, naona kina Flora, ni machanga ni kana nusio, au me, na wapi pasta? Pasta ni kwa mesau, ni mwewa ku, nenge wa matekai, ti mwewa ku, mateka wa chalo. Bada ya ewa mamu si, tutaenda kwa inilos inilos meati wani mami miseleni na misakwani na kikuyu inilos wa munda zake tutaanza na wale wa miseleni miseleni wajua miseleni pande za kangundo miseleni wale wa metoka miseleni wakuji kwa picha wale wa metoka miseleni kwa mke wake wa kwanza na itakuwa vizuri kama atakuwa na wao. Ila wewe na moteresia asuma miseleni. Ni maumivu yako ndio kwa saa nimekiene saa tunawashukuru kuja kujiunga nasi siku hii ambayo ni siku muhimu sana katika maisha yake Daniel Mandi mwenda zake. Hao ndio wazazi tuseme wazazi wa mke wake wa kwanza ambaye ni Teresia Kaleche kutoka Kangundo sehemu ya inaitwa Miseleni ni sawa na Miseleni watafuatwa na wale wa kutoka Misakwani na jua Misakwani ni kule kwa mbaa lole Ruth Zembi anatoka huko mbaa Tito wa Musyoki wale wa Museleni wanataka kusalimia neno moja nikupoke uh, jenda ya Yesu mwezo na kwa ni Musyo kwa mazina ni tawa Isaac Mudama uh, tume iteka ngundo Moisoni Tueti ya pole situ Kukwa Daniel Namba mwadhemba wande Kuitu nipo Kangundo mwesone Nipo Late Daniel Mandhi Humeti ya kiweti Tulesi ya kaleche Na hivi Mba kivanguli Nituweti ya Ukia kisi mituwe mwana Kwa nilaba ya Kivangu liyombe Na hindi mwene chairman ni wa family Kivangu ni family association Habu ya nuke ni mwakilishe Na tuwewe kwa mano Mba kivangu li Nimeiwa chairman kingi Ni kwansi ya Mudhoni wa Kwa ukia kie kai Mba mudhomba ombe Na alabu ukie ni asandi ngayi Aye Daniel Mandi 
Palawa and you pay Nasad. Near Sanda, I don't come on Galagon is here. Sia Mr. Lelican Gundo. A lany make what he and I don't come a co, Miss Aquani, Tito's family, number Lolame the Mevo, Tavadali, Natin Bosquaiva, Nalang. Namuma Butiosa Kutoka Apo, to Tanda Qua. She made you and Gini Kotoka Sam Sakiku Mali, Moniki Ameoa, Niwengi, Nawana Ongoswa, Nam Chungaji. Limuru, Kikuru, Limuru, Koivo, Kiambua, Kimadiza, or at India, Koivo, which is a rich more caribou. We had planned a, a song for the team from Limuru. Lakini like because of time factor, yani different at Aungea, we know Pengini Mbremba Siko Ngini. Basi. Asume, asume, most of those are brothers to Ruth. Na one of the brothers, Benjamin, atawasalimia. At Pasante sana. Pilita. Tosiani wena Ruth Nzendi. Um, ni mwina wa. Na ni mkuwe wa angi. Na ni andi wa andu wa ingi. Nienda kwa mandi. Netu wa mwasia. Hey, brother Museo. Na weke tumi muno inaiti ya nesa. We are happy. Major, I salute you. Uh, Kila kenge ni kwa siya. Ivita family ya tito. Uh, tuenda tuende ya kwezi watuendo na family eno ya mba mudemba. Nuendo tuwezi ya tuendo na mokwa ivinda ya saa. Na yeka kwezi ya tuendo isu ya kiendakame tuya tui. Kwa utu mwumishei utui moseo. Thank you. Ndeto nzeo inena wao Asanda Ben Kisolongi eh, ukuatia nela Nuku wetu ni Kikundichu mete ngalikoni ya Limuru Ambacho kinaongoso ala reference Gitau ambao nilikuwa Nimewambia nime Wata peana huwa Wasungumuse Walikuwa wenyulize na wapatie Nafasi ya wimbo but because of time factor, they may not sing today. Na maa minabe adho nangima kuma mekune, na maa yeyo yombanya. Na suma mekune, maa yeyo yombanya, tunawana, kunawana funzi kutoka machako si academy, mahali, mtoto wake, dani hivya nasomea, wako hapa, tunapatia nafasi wapeani huwa, so that they can be able to go back to school on good side. Uh, kanisa la buwana, buwana asifiwe Amen Buwana yesu asifiwe, kanisa la machakos Amen uh, Jina langu ni kama vida mesikia Reverend Andrew Getao Na Hii yote ni jamii moja Ya dugu na dada Wa uh, Inlos Wa hii jamii ya uh, uh, Makao Tume peana mschana wetu Ambani dada yetu Kwa yule muzee ama kijana wa makao ambaye naitwa Elijah Mwaniki Kwa hivyo bibi yake ni dada yetu Na tumetoka pande za limuru Hata kama tunaishi pande balimbali za taifa la Kenya Lakini mama yetu wako pale ni mzee Angeweza kufika Na katutuma diyo tuweze kuleta la birambi la, za jamii yetu Na kwa sababu sisi tunamini uh, yesu kristo ningetaka tu kufariji jamii ya makao na pia jamii ya manthi kwa andiko ambalo yesu aliacha alituachia katika kitabu cha yohana mtakatifu uh, sura ya kumi na nene mstari wa kwanza wakati alijua anaondoka kurudi binguni 
na akaambia wanafunzi wake ya kwamba ataenda walishikwa na hofu na huzuni ambayo hutushika wakati mpendwa wetu anaondoka na akawaambia maneno haya ya kwamba msifadhaike mioyoni mwenu amenene Mungu na muniamini mimi kwa hivyo imani ndani ya Yesu ni imani iliyo imala kabisa hiyo imani ndani ya Yesu haiwezi yani ni imani ya ukweli ni imani haitengiziki na imani ambayo tunaweza kutegemea kwa hivyo ombi letu ni ya kwamba Bwana ataweza kufariji mioyo yenu pengo ambalo mpendwa wenu mpendwa wetu ameondoka ataweza kulizimba na amani ya Bwana ipitao ufahamu wa mwanadamu itaweza kulinda mioyo yenu na yetu yote ambao tunampenda Daniel ndani ya Kristo Yesu. Kwa hivyo Bwana awabariki na watende mema. Amen. Asante kutoka Limuru. Tunawalika tuna sasa majirani neighbors atujapatiwa neighbor atatangulia oh mikuini kwanza mikuini wale wametoka mikuini pamoja na Simon wakuje mikuini na kati watoto kutoka Machakos Academy tafadhali karibieni ili wao kutoka muingie Machakos Academy students wanafunzi pamoja na walimu wao kama wako Sasa ni wakati wa manjirani neighbors Oh sorry Tumsifu Yesu Kristo Bwana Yesu asifiwe Am um, Karo Mulu Immaculate Bibe class teacher Machakos Academy and In person I never knew the deceased but me so rest in peace Machakos Academy fraternity wametutuma kuja kuipa hii familia pole na tunasema pole na tunawaombea Mungu azidi kuwapa neema na azidi kuwapa uvumilivu because nimekuja na some of the students her classmates mmoja wao atazungumza our represent praise god praise god, praise god once more so on the behalf of Machakos Academy students, we have come here to send our condolences to the family of Immaculate and we pray that God is going to give you strength. Be blessed. Basi mkirudi shule, salimia nikiludi ni the principal. 
Eh, kaita sie ni la la la, la mutui. La mutu atu yela no ne ba no 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 adoni. Ko wa adoni kaita tamba to to sa adoni membe ya gabanini. Yiba njini kasibe ba o kaita la ya adoni. Na yosa ni sia na mundungi o ngalukwe enge kibeti kenge mutui. Ba malandi na utaume yuruluki kitu njini yuka. Jimmy Gasibi ndiyo njirani atapeana hiyo ya majirani na beki beti kingi cha ba muingo ba kwa kwa chove kuka mane ngane na Jimmy no no nyua tu yera me mwe bakube na tia na chova na kibeti kiva ndwa ya nuo suka na ilaji kuati ya ili ingine tafua tani ya ya uko ambaye tapeanwa na mzee Alison Kituli kwa hivyo wao wakemaliza Alison Kituli huwa tayari kuitokeza upeane hiyo ingine ya uh, mbuga kilani ni clan ambua ah, wanaongozwa na Arizon Kitoli na wale wengine kina Musimi Jafet na wenzao yangu ni shukrani kubwa kwa maafisa wa polisi wakubwa na wadogo wale mumekaa na mandhi hiyo miaka yote mpaka siku hii yake ya mwisho sababu kama sio kupendana na kufanya kazi pamoja kama angetoroka kasini amunge kuja hapa hiyo ni shukrani kubwa sana ya pili ni wachungaji wote wale wamekuja hapa sababu ya mbezi Yeye ndiye alitufundisha Sunday school mafundisho ya upatisho miaka ya 1968 na wale wamefundishwa tumeandumu katika Ukristo na yeye mpaka wa leo ni asia mbezi no tukonete we mwingi aibundishi osiana isu yake ni watu bundishi Sunday school na yango mulili kana ainzumbo imbe anindwa ne na alus na nengi ni tesie kondo ambia o kila woko chuma ni uko janga kwa otekite bedi maundu wande ni mangai ni asa kila kingi mwana kyo watu tia ne tungia ba maladi na namba ya bedi mobe ya wiulu nundu bai mundu ne woke madikoni lakini ne wendo wa ba maladi na namba ya bedi ola meka liete na go icho ke tumu moko na ndu mokie kwa wingi mudembo yu tio go ba ili ikala nesa wethi andunio kakwa kuta metite we kala nai no uwe we ya nangia no ya cha andu malilo ko kuthika ithike wethayo na balaba sio no balaba ngai ndotonyo twika ukanda kilabu moka wa andu ana tano mutume andu okine na mumbabu wethela laba ngai na twadime na twika nesa bethi umesia na nondo itise we mutangiye uno zelile Izio nde miaka mundu e miongo mwanza na alamu ape tukanga kio baati yangai na nengi tu imane bala wezi ndo imande ya wezi ayo kanoti ya chetu ya siya wezi uluandi asanti usindi kiongozi wa ambaye na niyo seo tuye tu mutila ni wandanga muno na ratu muka yutu mkulia mutile mutile wezi edo na mundu wakale ya unena na ima video nengi ya mwana suwe bala ibikiei kwa hivyo tunawaomba wale watakuja saa hii wasiongeze maneno mengi kwa maana kama ni committees mlipeana rambi rambi nikupeana huwa sasa tuanze na committees committee sisi zilikuwa ngapi ya waja hii ameswa
kwa mtii kutoka Manza. Kwa mtii kutoka Manza. Manza 1, Manza 1, uji ni self help group. Manza 1 ndio wataongoza. Najua ni ilikuwa komiti yake ya nyumbani. Kule sehemu za Manza. Upande wa Dome. Manza tafadhali karibu Manza na wale wametoka pande ya Manza Dome kama mungejiunga na yeye Ukaini kenda with the mwako atatiani hapo mwe tuo kwa wakati kwa maana sasa wakati umeenda sana na tukikosa kujitahidi kuna mambo yataharibika na tujenda bana ngikiondo ndenge tupikie balaba sio asuni mo manatuwa na manji kuya utuye semu ya dhome kuya manza kenya israel na baumbe mime kalina na musi wake kumesa na nojomu wana mkitu mie moka nikenda ma ma mutani sinake wapate kwa chana ye kwa njia ya ya nzuri Kunyesha bila walikuwa na shirikiana na yeye alipokuwa hai. Asanti, asanti. Si kama kuna Eka hii endo a Kristo tukaenda nenda ya ni amwai. Mwai ni mudheu. Ni mune museo. Mabinda on there. Museo. Eh. Kwa si etwani tawawili wa mbiti. Misa kwani wajitayarishe. Na ninye chairman wa kikundi kicha manza wani kujini self help group na cha kwa no kuweto kia kisho kwa siya na siya mandi kibeti chake kibeti chake ili na ye ningimuya we mandi ni sima ikali tendaisa na ke na nae member unai mudanga hu kikundi ni kitu na nengi ukia kisho la mwenene na moto uma kwa ngai hindi Mwe kwa chingi hii na nusio. Asante. Misa kwa ndi wanafuata. Misa kwa ni funeral association. Karibuni. Misa kwa ni viongozi na wana pita musau na chama ni na wana Jackson Musioka wa mekunja. Kama kuna wangini watayunga na wawo kitapadhali ogoni wakati. Tulika asenoti lazima mbuke inyone. Alamu ibakuwe. Mwaka ni mwaka wakilisha. Na wethi ni tuwa adhi. Ondu tuwende tenesa. Awa ndiyo misakwani funeral association. Misakwani funeral association. Nandiyo. Wanaudumu katika hii eneo. baada ya committees tutaenda kwa organized groups organized groups itatanguliwa ita, ita, ita na AIC dome AIC dome ndio atakuwa wa kwanza msa kwani funeral wa santi wamebadiliza vizuri na wame wameacha nafasi kwa wengine AIC dome tafadhali tafadhali AIC dome tumeona kwaya tumeona pastors tumeona wazee wa kule dome nizamu yenu sasa baada ya dome tutakuwa na wenda wenda ukooka wenda ukooka na niazeri wenda nuka na hita ndo nenda tuitabuwa hita no wenda ukooka hii au ni AIC dome pastors wazee wanawake au wote wanashiriki wana, wana AIC dome walikuwa wanashiriki pamoja na mwenda zake ndani ya mandhi pamoja na nyumba yake kinarudi nzembi na watoto wao wenda ukooka ni nafasi yako baada ya hawa wenda yuka 
Ndio mimi ndio manena ondo makaketha ni kama ni pastor ama mmoja wao. Asalimie. Bana asifiwe. Bana asifiwe tena. Kwa tuto yeta we Yesu. Amen. Eh, tunakushukuru Mungu kwa Yesu. Eh, nafasi tulikuwa na Daniel Mandi na familia yake walikuwa washirika wa YC Dhome. Personally nilimjua 2017 vile niliingia YC Dhome na tumekuwa nao wakifanya kazi ya Bwana katika hiyo kanisa until wakati alituacha. Hata alituacha tukiwa pamoja na yeye tulienda kumuona hospitali pastors three of us na tukaomba na yeye na Mwenyezi Mungu akamponya kwa kumchukua. Kwa hivyo tunashukuru Mungu na tunawashukuru wote kwa kukuja kufariji familia. Asanteni. Asante pastor. Wenda ukoka ni mwasu ni mauma. Wenda ukoka ni mwasu na ni wewe utokeje? Am jamboni. Mimi si jambo kwa majina naitwa Judy Mudoka. Nimetoka upande wa huko Manza. Tunashirikiana na mama Ruth Nzembi ni mmoja wa mama katika kikundi chetu na kazi ya wamama uh, tulipewa jukumu ya jikoni kwa hivyo wakati walipatwa na msiba tuliingia kwa boma yake tukawa tunamshika mkono kwa mambo tofauti tofauti kwa hivyo ninaomba Mungu akawafariji kwa nyumba yake na wote ambao tulifika hapa kuzindikisha ndugu yetu uh, nikisema vile nimemjua Mandi ni mtu amekuwa wa maneno machache hata na zembi vile vile yako hivyo. Kwa hivyo Mungu atubariki sisi wote na atuone wema. Asanteni. Asanti. Nataka ufuate ni kina Mawa. Nataka za advocates wa Kaiser Association na ni kama niliona sini ya kanzo matata atangoza hicho kikundi. Sini ya kanzo tafadhali. Au ndio waajili wa, wake Ruth Zembi. mawa eh? matata sini akanzo matata wana karibia zambi utayunga na wawo nita imwe ba mwe nyuma mawa ukayo imwe mawa ni majakos advocates and workers association wako na kiongozi wawo Sini ya kanzo, karibu. Baada ya mawa, wataka ufugata ni kina heroes of faith. Heroes of faith. Pia naambiwa kuna matata and unforgates. Watakuja mbaada ya hawa. Ni wawo, ni wawo. Ni wawo, ni wawo. Santi. Santi. basi watafugato na heroes of faith heroes of faith kama mnaweza ku, ku, kuanza kujiandaa mkaribie hello um ndio mpendi ngodala mwiba mwanzio Eh, ndio mambo ndio mambo mbeke zangu. Na basi pazangu. Kwa ndene 2022 isn't it? Na nzembi na logo mimi, logo mimi za kati kwa 1991. Ndio gani? Miaka la tuani. Wewe hmm. galana mondo kila mada na. Uma mande mpaka sadite. Na <laughs> kuinga sura onomwe zembi wa that. For those mwa uh, jamia gana. For that one years. Wana mosee wo no na mwezi. Wona za u mono ko vufsi na nduka manai. Wana no balaka na musical. So I'm saying in essence that this is a very calm family. Yeah. Yeah. Do I know it? Yeah. 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 Y
Ana mwezi wa Orlando kwa maono ya nyobita. Ni wa kene ne kuma kyo kwa paka wiyo. Kwa hivyo naomba Mungu amweke mali pema peponi. Airutelia. Uno zembi alikaza ilana kwa nona alikabo. Thank you. Eh iros kwanza. Na ito uri kwa na isi kama na kama kana na muna kana kala na mandi is kiateka mtu mtu karibia hapa na kutambua kwa kazi nzuri ambayo mmefanyia mwenda zake mali Ni heroes of faith. Mwana mmaliza. Mtu yuko wapi? Is there? Is this one? Kwa kuna ngai manosimo kono ngwe kadona mundu subite baba yo basi. Asante mtu. Kwa mtu enda katika nyanya. Anyanya alane baba. Nitu uri ngongo na is Anyanya alama ukite Kwa niyaba ya siya na siya Siya mandi nyumba ya ruthi Ati ya nafunzi mayadi Nibe thabe ya nana mkukunoka ama mna ni Aya Anyama ukite baba Nundundu na nana ma Ma mbevi Toki wakata tu na umeata tu Toki an Akada tu na umia tatu wese kuzaita amina kivini kimu Ingia kasi ni umetoka mbari ni kasi From kibwesi Kwa ya ba umewandweli Kulaka umeku umewandweli Wese kuhithia friends Nisi akapuchiwa Asante. Uke ni tuminete. Sikulu wa masi ni ete rambi rambi kwa family ya mandi. Ni mwana. Na Elijah kendo ni ki. Tuwa mboya na tuwa mwenka renji. Na cha mudia. Elijah E. Muingo. Amerika. Ni wana mandi ya classmates yake Kenya. Si wande? Out of the class of almost two, almost nusu. Na tuige ya, ite tae miwete ba Kenya. No kuni weko biemwe. Thank you. Kuhutu waka ba, tuie na family amandhi. And finally, family amandhi. The Lord is there. And you are lucky you have pastors in your family. Including our bishop, who is also my bishop and my pastor. God. God bless you so much. Thank you. Asande. Wana mtaba. Eh. Ya. Ya ni wants to talk about something on behalf of those who are in abroad. Eka imo kelenda anews klisto mwea seo. Na kwenye museo. Nita wa John and Ziko Kingoi kuma masii. Na I'm talking on behalf of the friends of Elijah in the diaspora. Uh, we have been with Elijah for the last 22 years now. To a calendar na ke na ewa service ya family linking alikuwesu. Na you need to be very proud and umane sakuwa ni nundo. Pai mundo wako mana na Elijah kana muaniki utese mi sakuwa ni. We call them the ranges of Ivetti or the Alps of Misakuwa ni. Na Elijah ambi yewe atumiwa na umane misakuwa ni muingo Kansas. Kudi kusoma mbiti kaka. Na mbiti na umesomete Na about 6 years ago Angu ni asimu ambia Mbiti siya Kansas Ni yeti yethi na Na nui viengisi ya California Sina kaka akadlika angu Kwa uwe adhe meyeku And we have been friends with him And keeping in contact Na kwenye nga family Our condolences to the family And the rest of the community Thank you Asante Yaani wasi wa mundu kane na ayo baloyo Onaweba asanweba kubi Mwani kienena Ewa Amerika kane na kuu 
Kwenye makanisa Anenda kuita Osti Kanisa Ya isi mesa kwani Ambi Pastor Cornelius Mbuya is the person in charge ya isi mesa kwani Atasugumusa lava Karibisha wale wengine Mbaye <laughs> Nitwitonne <laughs> Nakasa mimuku kutumipisa. Mita umaba u. Kuhidindi sisi ya misakwani. Nika na yuke na yon. Ito chale kudocha mamu ite manza. Nanga yituika nesa. Sanji. Atuna shukuru mungu. Kwa nafasi kama hii. Ambayo ametupatia kama wachungaji katika sehemu ya misakwani tunasema asante kwa kuwa na ndugu yetu na mama yake tungaji pamoja nasi tunasema pole pole sana we want to call upon them so that they can take the rest of the program mpaka wakati wa karibu mkubwa Asante Master of Ceremony. Ya sani tu kuonataka nini mungu wa jipinda. Masahani mwenye ndiyo mungu. Na netu yitu yiku wa kiri mkiasa. Ya siya mungu family. Ya isi ya mungu wa wana itu. Itu wa isi ya mungu kumi. Tutu kumahana ake. Na netu kia musi ni uyu. Nikaithi watu na ingemone rambi rambi zitu kwa ati wa mama remu Pamwena siyana asiai family yonde atui na ma friends marafiki Alama umi yeku ndukweke madhukani Ya zetu ikuli itu programu itu hiki wangamwe Nika inatu kuenda tika ni nipiu hundo patoneka Kwa hini kwa mba ukuli ya office ya siyalani ukita na muu Mau nga mimu mwone Nini nitu kuna visa Atuwa mina Atu kutho na tuma wana ni otu nini Atuwa anduwa eli Kumana ingwanda eli Kumana yungu na teke mwaka na ili Na gini nukili Atuwa umavu kutu tunge Chadhi kwa mwadhu kanisi ya wachadhi Akuri ngurubu ya pressure and worship Matuwa nyotuini wadhi umwe Na hindi pasta wale yomba nyetipu kwa unenga nendeto No umwe kwa office as maitu Tukane wa hindi mwanya Tumino kileje Kwa huu, na uliza office as wale ni mekuja na uote Mweze kusimama Na mwisonge hapa karibu Tuchukuliwa picha Pamoja na mwezetu Yes. You need to watch the position is there. We tuma and do mapping do come more so we tina can amount money and I see and do. A monetary mongo position in Lanzo and yes. To the man pandilin in the other side, please. The other side was over your camera and all in the room pandil.
Tumechanganyikiwa kamera naona imerudi tena saidi. Yeah. pande moja hatuwezi pigwa pande zote. Huko ndio sawa. Huko ndio main. Huko ndio main. Haya, chukua dako kwanza bas. Unamaliza. It's okay. Sawa sawa. Yeah. Okay. Unaweza keti. Acha ni baki na olive na kamau. Nitauliza hao officers wawili kwa dakika moja ama mbili waweze kusalimia nyinyi na kupeana ponde. Hawa ni officers wale walikuwa wanafanya kazi na marehemu. Mmoja ni officer anasimamia officers wale wengine wote. Mwingine civilian staff. Huko tunafanya pia na civilians. Usiniulize mbona wametokea wapi civilians? Hata hiyo bunduki hiyo mnaona hiyo. Wataalamu ni wa civilians. Na yule anajua vile inatengenezwa ikiharibika Uyo napatea simu sa, eh, sa sauti sa hizi, kipasha sauti. Ndo mudalamu ya nini? Ya mbunduki. Hata kutengene za hizi. Kwa hivyo, ndo waliguwa napatea maraimu mbunduki, na wale wengine, alafu tutaendelea. Taika moja tuwa mbili. Kwa na muke ya situa ni ya Yesu Kristo mwenye ya seo ingi? kwa masitwa ni itawa olive kasio kawa nduda na ni tunathukumie na makauwa ila watu join ya kuma wote na ondu kwa neno na ndo ingi makau anai mundu wa ndeto nini ndana ndeto mbingi ya kuithia na kukeitha siya na akavita haka uyu visi ni kwa kia atethia uya wake na haka umabu haka thibalaba angi uendete kwa ukuwa family ya mandi tunamuita makau ni asia ni mkuelewa kwa family ya mandi tu asia mwigwe mwia kia kisi Nitu wa muki ya kisia na uki ya kisia wa Yesu Kristo. Na muithi muka mane ini nzea ya kila mundu. Ithio ndetu eleke elevu. Stage ya kuya abika kuma uka umana wakati ya nangi maende. Adhi muhimu nona ngaye mwe kanesa. Bwana Yesu wapewe sifa. Basi nami pia ni afisa wa polisi. Ni vile sija va kirasmi. Ni nafanya na ofisi ya county commander. Hapa machakos. Na jamii ya polisi tunaweza kumpoteza mmoja wetu Na tunasema ni pole kwa jamii Tutaweza kushirikiana kwa yale ambao mungu atatuwezesha Kwa muda ambao tuko katika dunia hii Kwa hivyo kwa jamii ni poleni Na tumechukua na uzito kwa sababu walikuwa mmoja wetu It's part of me also as a police communication officer Makao ama mandi Alikuwa mutu wabawa nafanya kazi ya signals Signals is like a media personnel. Tulikuwa kazi yetu ni kupasha zile habari ambazo tunapokea. Kwa hivyo ni nashukuru sana kupata nafasi hii na nawapa pole. Thank you so much. Asante. Yuni wenda wakuna pole. Pole. Sia office as one day. Yonde. Kwezi lakwa mwane witu. Kula tuta inake, tana weza kupika pao, nunduwa itu mingi siya kiwea. Na tutumie, tuketuna ingane pole, kwa family yonde, siya na kama maremu, na ando onde ma kisi yonde kiki, kwa kutiwa ni muanosu, wenyu, ngome wangi, ite wa siya na osia ke, na munyanya e, kwa ando ingi. Ito hitho kumida na makaone ya saa. Humo ila tuwa kia nyechuka kuu na mwedhi ya kuu. Na ito hitho kumiyo miaka kwa kuwe ili. Kwa ni mwisi. Hei mwedhu kumimoseo kwa kiserekali. Kwa hui serekali ni ya isi omono. Kwa mwe asia. Kwa isi omono na ito kia. Ito kwa tea ni hindi pamwe. Ni kwethi wa rumo nae tuto wanya kumunenga. Nda ya siya kesi ya mudia. Ndo baiki ndo kingiri tuto wanya kumunenga. Mwe ya mina kumosa. Kila tu mwika ni kumunenga kumumasi ya nesa tumubicho dhumu wane wake wa mudia 
Ondoa kutubu wa matuto make. Na hindi, he ujumbe wa police. Ula unenga ni itue kuhumba kwa inspector general. Through the county police commander. Na ni muandike. Na ni nguusoma. Na ni usoma ondu uandiki itue. Through the county police commander. Letter of condolence of number 54173 Police Constable Signola Daniel Mandi Makau. Wandi kito na kisunguro na chongo soma. The Inspector General of Police, National Police Service, the entire police service, both uniformed and the civilian staff wish to convey our heartfelt condolences following untimely death of your husband, Daniel Mandi Macau. Hukwa no one dressi to kwa kama ke, ala ni teresi ya kaneche, na ruthi nzembi. According to our records, the late number 54173, PC Daniel Mandi Macau was born on the 23rd December 1962 in Machako's County. Machako's County Ivete location, Misakwani sublocation, Misakwani Village. He was enrolled at Chambuko Primary School in the year 1970 where he sat for East Kenya Certificate of Primary Education in the year 1977. After his primary education, he joined Mill Secondary School in 1987 and sat for Kenya Certificate of Secondary Education in 1985. He was enlisted in Kenya Police Service on 1st September 1987 as a recruit constable. After his initial training in GSU Training College in 1988, he was posted to General Service Unit Training School in Bakasi, where he served for 14 years as a Singinola. He was later transferred to Machako Sub County in the year 2002. Later served under Tharaka Sub County, Embu Provisional Radio Room, Makueni Police Sub County Headquarters, and finally Machako's Police Headquarters, where he served until his demise. Daniel Makau has been ailing for some time, but he has been on and off from hospitals. Hospitals like Brickstock Park Hospital, Machakos Le Wolf 5 Hospital, Shalom Community Hospital. On 15th August, July, on 15th August, sorry. On 15th July 2022, he fell sick and was rushed to Shalom Community Hospital where he was admitted, suffering from hypertension. His condition deteriorated and passed on while undergoing treatment on 25th July 2022 at 14.20 hours. Daniel Mandi Macau was a hard working officer who was admired by many but the cruel hand of death has robbed us of his valuable services. He survived by two spouses, Teresia Kaleche and Ruth Zembi, 
and four children, two daughters and two sons. May the Almighty God rest his soul in enter an office. Amen. The Paloa Isu, see and the gate to a Tio Mamaremu, and the ascending Mavic is a co piece is sure. When I don't see to manage. Go to him, Matico Niasu, we managana nitro is here, or more we two. A number got to move me as here, we are an anon, to a little any quicker. Only ascending and dick work in Mukasa. Ningotunga, Kane, Nikomaduka, and Sewa Chade, Nikay, the water Yarishi. Praise and worship, at least one song. Pastor, Lani referent to Kianake, or officer, Mazetu, I take over from there. A Sandy Maduka, and Sewa Chade. Near Sandra, a band. Near Sunu and Yuziran, as you see, and you made a band. That is that's the only way I, I could address him. You can ask him in any day. You need your the two hunger me. Nangikula coordinator. Okay, Baba. Kwanda here. We have been very patient and the time has run short. Utongo is here. Kwa worship chorus. You can have Uchunga younger me. Basi tukiwa katika hali ya kusimama tunaimba mwambie inayosema umwaminifu ili tukampishe mumbiri wa siku ya leo ili akaweze kuleta ujumbe wa Bwana tusimame Umwaminifu Yesu Umwaminifu Bwana kila siku na kila saa Umwaminifu Yesu tuimbe pamoja Umwaminifu Bwana Umwaminifu Yesu kila siku na kila saa Umwaminifu Bwana Umwaminifu Yesu Umwaminifu Bwana kila siku na kila saa Umwaminifu Bwana Umwaminifu Yesu Umwaminifu
tunafika tamati ya kupata kusikia kutoka kwa kwa Mungu wa amani mahusia yako Mungu wa majeshi zaidi baba ukazungumze pamoja nasi sana sana mioyo wale ambayo tulio hai mchana na jioni hii ya leo kwa ajili ya jamii kwa ajili ya wake zake watoto wake wazazi wake jamii nzima kikosi cha national police service pamoja na watu wote ambao walio hapa katika jina la Yesu Kristo kupitia kwa neno lako Mungu wa amani ukaweze ukanene pamoja nasi tunapungua ili wewe ukaongezeke Mungu wa macheshi ukatuelekeze sawa sawa na neno lako zaidi Mungu wetu kitutia moyo ukituimarisha katika vipindi hizi za mwisho kwa maana jambo moja ni kwamba watu wataondoka lakini wewe Mungu utabaki milele na milele asante kwa maana wewe ni mwaminifu tumekuona tumekuhesabu hakika Mungu tamalaki kupitia kwa neno lako Mungu wa majeshi ukazungumze na watu wako Mungu mkuu ukanitumie kama chombo tu kama kwa utukufu wa jina lako wewe ukaongezeka na mimi nikapungue Mungu wa majeshi ninasema ni asante kwa jina la Yesu Kristo tunaomba na atakuamini amen, amen. Bwana Yesu asifiwe sana amen ah kuchukua fursa hii kwa jamii ah wake zake kwa ndugu yetu marehemu ambaye ni Daniel Makao eh wake zake wote wawili sana sana tulikuwa tunafanya mara mingi na Ruth za alipokuwa mgonjwa mimi ndio nilikuwa askari wa kwanza ambaye nilikuwa sana sana ninatuma nikipitia tu simu na Ruth mimi ndio nilikuwa mtu wa kwanza kukimbia pale kwa kama askari na mchungaji na nikiwa na mawasiliano ya mkubwa wangu ambaye alioko hapa ambaye aliyekuwa akiongea hapo awali Aa, na mara mingi nafika pale naomba na watia moyo hadi juzi hiyo siku ya mwisho alinipigia simu kaniambia Daniel hayuko vizuri sana nikakimbia kwa dakika kama kumi nikafika pale hatimaye ndugu yetu alituacha tukiwa pale pale na tukasema nikaambia wao kwamba hatuwezi kumlaumu Mungu bali inafaa tumshukuru kwa maana ndugu yetu alikuwa amepambana na uchungu wa mwili na Mungu anapopumzisha amemuondolea uchungu bwana asifiwe sana Uh, watumishi wa Mungu ambao walioko hapa askofu kababu pamoja na watumishi wengine ambao walioko hapa wa kanisa la AIC madhehebu zingine mbalimbali mbali, wachungaji watumishi wa Mungu nyinyi ni watu wa maana sana Mungu wa amani awabariki sana uh, mkubwa wangu ambaye alioko alioweza kutangulia Mungu akubariki sana na hivyo kwamba uh, tuko kwenye kipindi ambacho ni cha mwisho ya kusikia mahusia yake Mwenyezi Mungu. Majina yangu naitwa Reverend Daniel Polong Kasisi ambaye na hudumu na National Police Service nikiwa mchungaji pale. Uh, mimi ndio ndio ninayesimamia uh, nikiwa hapo County Headquarters na ninaakilisha ofisi ya National Police Service Chaplains Kenya mzima uh, kunayo katika ngazi ya kitaifa na wanaelewa kwamba tuko katika maeneo haya vya kwamba kwa niaba ya ofisi ya Chaplains National Police Service Kenya tunapenda kupeana pole zetu kwa familia kwa niaba pia ya familia yangu napeana pole zangu kwa familia Uh, tujitie moyo katika Bwana na hivyo kwamba tukaweze kutazama mbele. Nataka tuende tuingie katika neno la Mungu kwa sababu ya masaa.
tunaona mawingu Tuende tuingie katika neno la Mungu Mimi ni askari mia kwa mia Hayo magwanda ambayo hao wengine walio nayo Mimi pia niko nayo na hata nilitoa tu kufaa magwanda hayo mengine ya kikuhani hivyo kwamba mimi na udumu kwa upande wa polisi na na udumu pia pia kuha, kama kuhani katika National Police Service hivyo kwamba katika kila kitengo yote uh, National Security kuna chaplains kama sisi na ndio sisi ndio tunaisimama na wenzetu katika kuambia kwamba kando na kazi mbinguni ipo Amen, Amen. Nataka nisome neno la Mungu katika kitabu cha 2 Kings chapter number 17. 2 Kings chapter number 17. Wafalme wa pili mlango wake mlango wake ni mlango wa 17. Nitasoma mstari wa 25 kuanzia 24. Alafu ndio tukapate kuendelea mbele. Maandiko yanasema hivi 2 Kings chapter number 17 verses 24 up to number 28 Kisha mfalme wa Ashuru akachukua watu kutoka babu babuloni kuda ava hamadi na sefadhamu na kuwaweka katika miji ya Samaria mahala pa watu wa Israel wal, walio waliopelekwa uhamishoni wakakitoa miji hiyo na kukaa huko basi kulitokea kwamba walipoanza kukaa huko hawakumwabudu Mwenyezi Mungu kwa hiyo Mwenyezi Mungu aka akatuma simba miongoni mwao nao wakawaua baadhi yao halafu watu Walimwambia mfalme wa Ashuru mataifa uliowachukua na kuyaweka katika miji ya Samaria hayakujua ha, haya hukumu za Mungu wa inchi hiyo. Kwa hiyo Mungu huyo alituma simba ambao wan, wan, wanawaua. Ndipo mfalme wa Ashuru akaamuru Murudisheni kuhani mkuu kati ya wale walio waleta Mateka murudishe aende na kukaa na kukaa huko ili awaarifu awafundishe watu sheria ya Mungu wa inji hiyo kwa, kwa hiyo moja moja wa makuhani alioletwa nyara aliyotekwa alio nyara toka Samaria alikwenda na kukaa Bethleheli na huko aliwafundisha watu jinsi ya kumwabudu Mwenyezi Mungu nataka nisome tena katika nataka niongezee Jeremiah 30 not Jeremiah the book of Isaiah Isaiah that Isaiah chapter number 30 Isaiah chapter number 30 verses 1 and 2 Bapo maandiko yanasema hivi
Angu, wanaofanya mikataba kinyume na matakwa yangu nami na warudi na warundika dhambi juu ya dhambi acheni tuombe baba wa mbingu na nchi katika jina la Yesu Kristo tunakushukuru tunakuenzi nena pamoja nasi jioni hii ya leo kwa utukufu wa jina lako Tunapota matisha mambo yote hatutakosa katika kukushukuru Mungu wetu kwa jina la Yesu Kristo tunaomba na hata kuamini. Amina. Nataka nizungumzie kichwa cha ujumbe kwamba kumtafuta mchungaji. Bwana asifiwe sana. Kumtafuta mchungaji. Na nena hivyo kwa sababu maandiko inaelezea vizuri sana Second Kings chapter number 17 mstari wa 24 hapo ikiteremka inaelezea kuhusu kwamba kulikuwepo na wana wa Israeli waliokuwa wametekwa nyara na hivyo kwamba watu wa mataifa mengine wakaweza kuja wakakaa katika ndani ya michi yao maandiko matakatifu yanasema kwamba walipoingia katika miji ya wana wa Israeli walikuja na miungu yao maandiko yanaendelea kusema kwamba baada hapo Mungu akaweza kuwatuma simba ili kuweza kuwala watu. Bwana asifiwe sana. Haleluya. Ninashukuru Mungu kwa maana ninazungumza na kanisa la Kristo, watu ambao wanaitanishwa na Kristo Yesu, ambaye ni Mungu ambaye anaishi milele na milele. Biblia inasema kwamba maandiko inasema vizuri pa hapo kwamba watu wakaweza kuwa yani simba ikaanza kula watu ingekuwa katika na wakati huu wangeitisha Kenya eh ndio hiyo eh ndio na nani hao wildlife wangeitisha mara moja sasa kama hapa iko machui mafisi wale ambao wanaosumbua nganganga watu kukula mbuzi vitu kama hizo iko iko vitu hizi iko wanyama hapa Bwana asifiwe sana. Mungu yes. anasema hivyo kwa maana kwetu huko iko mingi sana. Pale Rift Valley Kajiado hapo tuko na wanyama wengi sana hapo. Hivyo kwamba Biblia inasema kwamba simba wakawa wanakula watu. Kukawa na ripoti kwa mfalme kwamba wale watu ambao uliowaleta katika ndani ya miji ya Israel hawajui desturi ya kumwabudu Mungu wa inchi nataka nizungumze na kanisa jioni ya leo kwamba Yesu Kristo ndio suluhisho mambo ya dini mambo ya mila mambo ya ya makamo hiyo hiyo mafitu yote hiyo Bwana sifiwe sana. Eh hey, makamote suji mwalimu Nati suji gani hiyo yote ambayo watu wameleta hao ndio wamebadilika kuwa simba inawala watu mchana. Eh hey, hey, ama namna gani? Hapa ni ama ni kwetu tu pale tukaja kwa tena kulanga watu. Eh hey, inaanza kuitisha kuanzia kwa kusuji kwa nani hapo? Hapo hapo kwa 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 baba mama suji nani atupate pesa atupate sijui nini utakuwa na faida gani ukipata ya hii dunia nzima na ukose ya pale mbinguni ndio sababu jioni ya leo nasema na watu wa hapa misagwani kwamba tafuta mchungaji mchungaji
mwenyeji mwema ni Yesu Kristo ambaye maandiko inasema hivi katika kitabu cha Yohana mlango wa kumi mstari wa kumi inasema kwamba yeye mwivi haji ila kuiba na hata kuharibu na hata kuua lakini yeye Yesu Kristo amekuja ili tukapate kuwa na uzima nao tele tele ndio mchana na jioni ya leo wewe ambaye unayenisikia wewe ambaye unayeniona unajua unajua unaanza kuwa na maswali mingi kama wale ambao wanasema nganga kwamba maswali kama yale ya polisi wengine wanajiuliza maswali kwamba je polisi anaweza kuokoka nataka ni kuombea my brother kwamba hata katika national police service katika KDF katika security zote za nchi yetu na hata nchi zingine kuna remnants wale ambao wanaosimama na kusema kwamba Yesu Kristo ni bwana tafuta mchungaji nani wacha kuwa na maswali mingi ya kusema kwamba kama polisi wanaweza kuokoka ama waokakanga gangi nataka nikwambie kwamba polisi wanaweza kuokoka na kuimarika na kudumu katika ndani ya Yesu Kristo hivyo kwamba sijabai magwanda tu atu kama kama tu ile 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 inetonga viu sasa Mapana. Bana sikia sana. Hey! Hey! Sijafaya magwanda namna hiyo. Nimepewa nafasi nzuri na National Police Service. Nikaenda nikasoma shule ya Bible School. Nikamaliza. Nikamaliza nikiwa chini ya kanisa langu na La Pefa tukiwa nyumbani. Nika nikakaa kama mchungaji chini ya bishop nikakuzwa nikaendelea kubiri baka uh, wilaya yetu na national pia wakasema kwamba anastahili apewe ngazi nyingine ya kuwa nani kasisi ili angalau nikaweze kuofficiate baadhi ya mambo kama haya hivyo kwamba saa hii naweza kuofficiate hii nyanga habari yenu by the way bwana sifio sana tafuta mchungaji nani wacha kuwa na maswali mingi kujiuliza unajua mara mingi watu unape, watu mara mingi wananyosha vidole mbili tu sahi ni kipoint huyu mzee namna hii ni vidole mbili ndio inamwangalia vidole nyingine tatu inaniangalia mimi bwana sifio sana tafuta mchungaji Ukipatana na mchungaji utakuwa salama. Amen. Bwana asifiwe sana. Amen. Hautakuwa salama. Bwana tukuse sana. Amen. Tuko kwenye dunia ambayo imejawa na mambo mengi. Kifo inakuja katika na all kinds of ways. Yes. Bwana asifiwe sana. Amen. Sio magonjwa. Hata mpaka saa iko corona. Hmm? mambo mengine ambayo hatujawahi kuyaona mm. na unasema tu ah wacha kidogo nivunje mifupa kama bado meno ipo <laughs> na nii utapoteza hiyo magego <laughs> na mwili hii itakapodhoofika sisi tunasema tu mwili mchanga ukarudi wapi mchangani lakini je roho yako itakuwa wapi ombi langu na himizo langu kwa watu wote leo hii kwamba tafutana na mchungaji wako ambaye ni Yesu Kristo maadamu bado unaishi ndugu yetu Daniel ameshakamilisha yake na wewe je utakuwa wapi hauji yes. kwamba labda wewe ndio utakuwa the next bana asifiwe sana eh, unajua tunasema nganga kwamba kuni ile ambayo iko kwa moto na ile kuni ambayo bado iko kando pale inaweza kucheka kwa ile ambayo iko kwa moto hiyo ni misema ya kwetu pepe pande hiyo tu peke yake sijui kama hapa iko hivyo bana asifiwe sana ile kuni iliyoko pale bado achana na ile ile kuni tayari ambayo mama ashaweka pale kwa moto inachomeka ama ndio inaivisha e, ile chakula hapo e, e, kale kanaweza kucheka na ajui kwamba yeye ndio the, ne, the next victim <laughs> tafuta mchungaji ukiwa bado uko na pumzi hii ambayo ni ya bure bwana asifiwe sana Amen. watu wa ile maeneo yale wa wana kelele mingi naamini wakainua matawi 
wengi wakisema haki yetu haki yetu kama bila huanga tu watu wa kawaida mambo yanapodhuka wanaanza kusema haki yetu haki yetu maaskari ma, ma, tu peke yao ndio hawainua gangi matabia wakisema <laughs> ati haki yetu aa sisi tunatulianganga tu namna hii mnarushanga mawe tu na wewe tu ndio utakuwa watini wa, 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 wa sana bwana asifiwe sana himizo langu kwa wewe ulie hai jioni hii ya leo tafutana na mchungaji wako ambaye ni Yesu Kristo ukishapatana naye utakuwa na uzima kwa maana mwili hii ni lazima ikaondoke lakini kilicho ndani ambaye ndio roho ambaye Mungu ndio anachukua hiyo pumzi na roho hiyo ataifadhi na hivyo kwamba kile ambacho umekuwa ukipanda kwa maana ukipanda ya mwilini utavuna ya mwilini ukipanda ya thambi utavuna ya thambi ukipanda cha rohoni utavuna ya rohoni Haleluya. Ndio sababu maandiko inasema hivi katika Zaburi 37. Mstari wa 37 inasema hivi, angalieni sana njia ya mtu mnyofu. Mwisho wake ni a- Kuna uzima wa milele na milele. Kuna amani milele na milele. Ya hii dunia hii hayakosi kuyatokea magonjwa, mablabla mablabla hayo yote. Lakini nataka nikwambie kwamba kuna moja aitwaye Yesu. Yesu ndio kiboko ya mambo yote. Na ndio sababu Paulo akasema katika First Corinthians 15:55, kifo iko kiko wapi nguvu yako? Mauti kiko wapi nguvu yako nataka nikwambie my brother my sister tafutana na mchungaji ambaye aliye na hatima yako ukipatana naye hakika maisha yako licha kwamba uko kwa hii dunia hii lakini Paulo akajitia kumguvu akasema kwamba nita nita akaendelea akasema kwamba nitayaweza yote ndani ya yule atakayenitia nguvu kwa sababu ni mchungaji akao pamoja nasi yeye sio wa kutoroka yeye sio wa kubadilika sio yeye sio yule wa bahali ambaye alienda transfer akawaambia atakuwa na kejeliwa naambiwa kwamba enendeni ukaangalie kama ameenda transfer enendeni mkaangalie kama ameenda ameenda kulala Mungu wetu halali wala hasinzi hey, haleluya ndio mchungaji wetu ndio sababu tunajivuna licha kwamba tunalia lakini tunajitia nguvu kwa sababu aliyekamilisha mambo yote ako hai leo hii na anasimama katika kiti cha enzi akiwa na tusupiri akiwa Mungu pamoja nasi anaitwa Mungu Immanueli kwa maana ako pamoja nasi huyo ndio mchungaji ninayetaka kukukuabidhi nalo Bwana sifi sana. Eh, tukimaliza hii mambo tutaondoka kila mtu kwa nafasi yake. Eh, si ndio hiyo? Mimi hatutapata na nafasi kama hii. Hii crusade ni ya maajabu sana. Ndugu yetu Daniel alikamilisha yake lakini sasa hii crusade yote ya hii ya leo hii hakuta kuepo na nyingine tena ya ndugu yetu Daniel. Bwana sifi sana. Lakini Ya kwamba saa hii kuna mtu saa hii ako kwenye ICU kuna mtu saa hii ako katika in critical condition na wewe unasema tu unajipiga tu ya unasema tu kikulacho kingoni mwako patana na huyu mchungaji yeye ni mnyenyekevu ndio sababu anakunenea hata wakati ambapo uko pale hospitalini ana yeye ndiye mponya kwa ajili ya mapigo yake sisi tunapata kupata nini kupona kwetu tunapovunjika mioyo yeye ndiye anayetukanda yeye ndiye anayetutia moyo kwa hivyo dada ya zangu ambazo ambao ambao tumewaa mzee wenu amewaacha nataka kuwa kapidi ni kweli wa mambo ni kwamba wanadamu wataondoka lakini kuna 
mchungaji mmoja yeye anaitwa Yesu Kristo yeye ndiye Mungu ambaye ndiye muumba wenu atabaki nanyi watoto wake mkaridhi katika ufalme wa mbinguni na pana anawaambia kwamba tafuta mkiwa wachanga tafuteni kwanza tafuteni kwanza ufalme wa mbinguni haya mengine yote yataingia tu automatically tu yataingia tu automa automatic patana na mchungaji wako sisi tusimame kwa miguu yetu mimi nimeamaliza tusimame eh tusimame lakini habari yangu leo nzuri ni kwamba patana na mchungaji wako amen eh wacha kwenda kanisa wacha kuja siku ile ambayo kuna ma, kuna maombelezi kama saa hii unajua kuna watu saa hii wengine wanasema kwamba hata hii hata hii sherehe au hawa watu wamea huyu MC amevuta sana huyu huyu pasi ah, amevuta sana si tunataka kwenda kufungua hmm? si namna hiyo eh hey, tunataka kwenda kufungua lock na ku... <laughs> nani tuliza boli tuliza boli nani patana na huyu mchungaji ukipsha patana naye hata hiyo kiu itaondoka automatically yeah. ah kareke bwana asifiwe sana yeah. haleluya patana na mchungaji wako tafuta huyo mchungaji yeye bado anapatikana ukisha patana naye you will never regret mimi nilipatana naye nikiwa askari tu namna hii yeah. si hata niliokoka kabla sijaandikwa kwa polisi hapana mm. nilikuwa tu katika national police kama saa hii saa hii niko na miaka zaidi ya ishirini nikiwa mchungaji angalia tu hiyo miaka ishirini hiyo sio sio siku mbili ama wiki mbili miaka bwana asifiwe sana na pado ninaweza kupambana na mlima wangu haleluya bwana asifiwe sana kwa sababu niko na mchungaji mwema nilipopatana naye katika nikiwa katika kazi ya polisi nikasema sasa nimepata yote kwa maana ndani ya Yesu ndio mambo yote hebu tufunge macho zetu tukaweze kuomba Baba wa mbingu na nchi kwa jina la Yesu Kristo tunakuheshimu tunakuabudu asante kwa ajili ya neno lako umetutia moyo Mungu wa amani wewe ndiye mchungaji mwema kando na wachungaji wengine kando na mingu mengine hatujapata Mungu mwingine wewe ndiye Mungu, mungu na muumba wetu katika jina la Yesu Kristo asante kwa kibali hii ya leo hii ya kuwa wazima mbele zako tunanyenyekea tukikuinua tukipungua tukitumbu makosa na dhambi yetu katika jina la Yesu Kristo fuatilia na neno lako watu wako Mungu wetu maadamu bado napatikana wakaweze kukutambua wakaweze kukujua maadamu bado napatikana katika jina la Yesu Kristo Sote tukiwa tumefunga macho zetu tuna tukiwa mbele za Bwana labda uko pale haujawahi kupeana maisha yako kwa Yesu Kristo hatukosi kusema jambo kama hilo kwa maana itakuwa hii ibada haina maana yoyote lakini tukisema Yesu ni Bwana ibada yetu itakuwa ibada imekamilika uko hapa na umekuwa ukifanya shughuli zako unajiona kana kwamba uko sawa wacha nikwambie kwamba ndugu yangu unaweza kuomba kama machoni pa watu wewe uko sawa lakini machoni pa Mungu uko bado na kasoro lakini Mungu wetu ana uvumilifu yeye sio mwanadamu yeye sio mwanadamu ageuke hasira yake sio mwepesi anaweza kukujilia Ka katika ile njia ambayo anaweza kukujilia ni ya maajabu unakosekana pale kasika kanisani labda unaendanga kanisa mara moja kwa mwaka wakati tunaposema happy new year 2023 kwa maana juzi tangu 2022 happy tarehe moja ulikuwepo pale ukishukuru Mungu nataka nikwambie kwamba ndio sababu Mungu aliumba siku hii ya leo tukue katika na majonzi ili Mungu akapale kukuzungumzia labda uko hapa haujawahi kupeana maisha yako kwa Yesu Kristo tafadhali ndugu yangu dada yangu inua tu mkono wako mahala popote ulipo Sikuambie kuja hapa mbele. 
Najua mara mingi watu wanaogopanga macho ya watu, wanaogopanga kuitwa hapo mbele. Lakini ni watu mkono wako. Mahala popote tunaponisikia. Wewe ambaye unayeniona hapa, wewe unayeniona katika maeneo ya mbali, kwa maana nina habari kwamba hii mambo hii inaenda mbali sana. Na jama kama hujapeana maisha yako, Mungu wetu hana upendeleo. Haijalishi sambuli yako, haijalishi hali zako. Labda hata manyumbani, labda wewe umewekewa uwande lakini nataka nikwambie kwamba unaweza kuwa kwamba hautamaniki machoni pa watu lakini kuna Mungu ambaye anaitwa Mungu wa mbinguni yeye wewe ni wa maana ni watu mkono wako mahala tu popote ulipo na ukasema ili ombi nyuma yangu sema bwana Yesu leo hii naja kwako nisamehe makosa yangu ukayavuti katika kitabu cha mauti ukaandika tena upya katika kitabu cha uzima wa milele na milele ewe Yesu na kupokea kama bwana na mokozi ukawe mchungaji wangu kaniongoze ukanielekeze ukaniimarishe katika chini ya jua Kristo utakapodhirishwa pale mawinguni ni kawe mshindi pamoja nawe kwa maana wewe ni mshindi mkuu asande kwa kunitambua asande kwa kuniokoa leo hii ninakiri kwamba Yesu Kristo ni bwana katika jina la Yesu Kristo tunaomba na atakuamini amen wote walio hai semeni amen, amen basi kwa nafasi hii nataka nipeane hii nafasi hii niite familia tafadhali uh, tafadhali familia nzima hiyo ya ndugu yetu ambaye ni marehemu wake zake watoto wake uh, wazazi wake kama ha, wako hapa pamoja na wengine wengine mnaweza kukaa chini tafadhali kwa dakika kidogo sana ambayo imesalia alafu tukaweze kukamilisha hii kipindi tafadhali familia wanaweza tu kukuja hapa mbele tafadhali familia tieni tunguvu ninawaambia kwamba Yesu ndiye mchungaji mwema yeye habadiliki sisi tutaondoka lakini kuna mchungaji mwema yeye hatawahi kuondoka yeye hatawahi kuwa absent apana yeye ni present kila siku tukiwa chini ya jua na hata katika na ufalme wa mbinguni mama njoo tu asante asante mama karibu asante nilipomuona huyu mama jana tulipokuja hapa nyumbani nilifurahia kuona mama miaka hii na yeye amekuwa mtumishi wa Mungu ni kustaafu tu lakini bado ako na strongness kwamba Yesu ndiye bwana na mokozi wa maisha yake. Naomba wachungaji pia wale ambayo wa kanisa letu la AC pamoja na wachungaji wote ambao wako hapa wale ambayo tafadhali kama kuna wachungaji njoni tu hapa tukaweze uh, kuwazingira hao watu ili kuwafunika wao na wingu la mbinguni kwa maana Mungu wetu yeye habadiliki tunapovunjika moyo yeye bado ni mwaminifu katika kitabu cha Yohana mlango wa 16 na thelathini na tatu akasema kwamba najua nyote mtaniondokea lakini jiko peke yangu nataka kuambia kwamba sisi tutaondoka lakini tunataka kuwakabidhi nyinyi katika na Mungu ambaye anaishi ndiye mchungaji ambayo wa milele na milele yeye ndiye mtakaye muita naye atawasikia anasema ni teni naye atawaitikia wacha tukanywe mikono yetu yote alafu tuelekeze hii familia baba katika jina la bwana wetu Yesu Kristo tuwaje mbele zako tukisema ni asanti bwana kwa kuwa umetuhifadhi mpaka wakati huu na tazama bwana tuiweka hii familia mikono ni mwako na bwana ukawe mlindaji wao ukawaongoze watakapokuwa wakitoka ukawaongoze watakapokuwa wakirudi na bwana mambo yote na matatizo yao bwana ukayachukue mikononi mwao maana yule bwana walikuwa anaegemea bwana hayupo tena lakini wewe upo daima bwana ukawaonekanie kama kuna jambo bwana linawatatiza e bwana ukalishike mikono na bwana ukaliondoe na bwana ukitenda hivyo 
Bwana sifa na utukufu yes. zitakuwa zako. Mm. Na ni katika jina la Bwana wetu Yesu Kristo tumeomba. Amen. Mungu wa amani awabariki sana. Tunaweza kukaa chini niwapatie tu mwelekeo ambayo tutakapo kuwa tukiondoka hapa e, naona ki sawa ah tunapoondoka hapa ah tutaondoka tukielekea pale kwenye kaburi ambaye pia ni nyumbani mwa ndugu yetu ambaye aliyetuacha katika hiyo hali tutakapokuwa tukienenda pale tutakuwa tuna uh, ambatana na kikosi yetu ya National Police Service uh, tukifika mahala fulani pale karibu na Kaburi hapo ndipo tutaweza ku, kuchukua mambo mengine yetu tukifika hapo kuna kuna sherehe zetu za mwisho sherehe yetu ya mu ya mwisho mwenzetu amelala na ni lazima tumpatie heshima yake ya mwisho kwa hivyo tukiwa pale kwa shima kwa sababu ni mahali padogo sana tafadhali tunaomba watu wakae kando kidogo ili tukaweze kukamilisha ile kipindi yetu ya mwisho na ni ya maana sana kwa maana tutapiga risasi pale na sio ya kuua hmm. na ukiwa na katika hali hiyo kama hiyo pia huwa tunasemanga hivi kwa wewe ambaye labda haujawahi kusikia usikaribie usipende kuja mpaka ati kwa masikio eh usikuje mpaka kwa masikio eh naambiwa pia pia hata kwa kwa wamama ukiwa ukiwa umejaliwa ukiwa umejaliwa tafadhali usikaribie hapo yes it is true it is true Hey. Ule ambaye unayebeba ni wama sana. Na hatutaki 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 <laughs> mambo mengine. Wewe ni wa maana aliye tumboni ni wa maana pia. <laughs> si ni kweli? Kwa hivyo mtupatie hiyo nafasi. Kwa nafasi hii nitarudisha kidogo kwa MC aseme jambo alafu baada hapo tutakuwa tunaelekea pale kuna wenzetu tayari wameshatangulia na kuna wengine wako hapa ambayo tutaweza kwenda kusaidiana na wao pale na tukifika pale kwa shimo tutakuwa na instructions ambayo labda ni watu tu wawili hivi mama namna hitu mchungaji api ambayo yule ambaye tutakuwa tuna kwa sababu shimo pale ni padogo sana Asante sana Asisi policeman Eh contrary to our expectations and our knowledge we have always thought the police work is in deal with the criminals and the law and order wazungumuzi mambo ya ya mbinguni umetubariki asante sana ikaina si you you need to there ba yambwani ni wanenga ni mwao asia alatu ya adhime tukadhibo to mwale wala ala mwekali oneva no oneva no kumeso kwenu na mbe ngadhebo hai ni ngi na kwasia hii the that is the police will, will be the pombearas tume ukwa mwi alwalangi tikama opswa kiti banzi yani pa atu wende rende ka sehemu kanini atuikwenda ndo inge muno but uh, there are some people i would wish to come here kendo ni mtu aiba kendo ni mtu aiba e baba kwendie mululuebo chao siebo asikula mebo ano muko ba asunitite mululu chao si kendo ni kasi ni omega na matebesi ya it is the same thing i'm trying to dig out Mululuka Mutu aiba aiba makenzi Ndana no command ye Okay they, they are very many coming here These people I'm calling here 
are cousins to the late Daniel. Alongside with what the police people would be doing, I would wish to advise you to go on down and stop at Mutesia's home there. So that when they come as far as that place, you can assist them to ferry the body to the place where they will study their ceremony. Alwalangi banzi ya ni muika atu wati ye Na muno muno mba ake nuka yu Indi ino Indi ino Tuwe ni alui Fekilaji Sorry Mutapiana Fekilaji Fekilaji will be there But if you belong to that category Please don't kwa kitu mike huyu ya tutapeana wana kaniza sasa hivi alafu itaita moja wao yani i have given you instructions you can start moving down to the ngurevu yard well and good wana kaniza itapeanwa lakini before that uu lu move for the thanks uka ba mululu mululu uka mululu uka ba i want to use i want to use you yani we want to kubate na fasi ya kutoa maneno ya mwisho after the wreath for the church has been given kanisa ukai ila ya kanisa manza manza ndiyo walikuwa wakishiriki wakishirikiana na na, na manzi kwa AIC manza thome 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 is manza is manza DCC AIC thome wa those who come from AIC thome tafarali pitani mbele Mai basi mando luka ende ba basa wa uye ni gaba ika labo. Oko a metuke. Lome ata kwa ya members wa here please link up with your pastor. Eh, I want us to settle Ilipotangulia nilisema sehemu ambalo tukonalo pali chini ni ndogo Kwa hivyo wanakuwa Yani Asimu unena mwiti na kwa ni munengema ikimunele We We unasungumza pale unatuadibia At this njanja Let me call upon Cosmas So that he can move forward of that Mabasa mekole ni wani munenge mwanya Na utafathali baisa ndoko oke inge nungu masani maathi na ina natike kuthia Kye wunenge Mabasa mekole ni DCC Mebo Mikuhine sore na ndiye no no mwa Anake anake manduwe utafathali let us go on down there So that we can cover the the grave Ii ayye di buba di kan ni bazel ni mo ni mo ni mo 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 for those who, who might not understand that one, I would want to say good evening. Uh, on behalf of the family of my late uncle, the Muthemwa's family, and the larger Malandi's family, I would say, I would want to say thank you very much. And before I do that, Nazima Niseme, Ni Mungu tu kwanza nitampatia shukura manake vile mambo yalianza toka siku zile kazi ni wetu alituacha Mungu ametuonekania tumeendelea vizuri tumemaliza vizuri there was calmness and again 
also the word of God, I was really touched myself. Thank you. Mkienda nyumbani, tunaomba tena mungu, aende na nyinyi. And again, the last thing is, wenye walitua vitu zao kwa ibomu. Tunashukuru sana, sana, sana na mahali ilitoka Mungu awaongeze. Na kama mmeona kitu kibaya, for example, this space ni kidogo. Najua kuna wenye wamesumbuka kiasi. Please sio kupenda kwetu. Kile kibaya mmeona, muache kila kizuri, muende naye. God bless you. If I were you, I would pay him. How do you pay someone like this? He has money. Just clap hands for him. Sasa, yani wanakasisi, this time around, itakupatia chombo. Ukituambea tuende right, tutaenda right. Ukituambea tuende left, we will land there. Kwa hivyo, sasa tuini ukeitu tuunga mei, tuini ya iwe. Naomba tu kwa sababu ya hii nafasi uh, niite Paul Beras wakawe tayari uweza kufika hapa ili tukaweze kuelekea kule mahala pa mwisho hivyo tafadhali Paul Beras tukaweza kuchukua ushukane wenu pamoja na komanda apparent komanda fire party komanda pale nyumbani na hivyo kwamba pamoja na familia pamoja na mipango ya kufikisha huko kwa sababu hapo ni mbali kidogo naomba kuwa na ushirikiano ulio mzuri na Mungu wa amani awabariki kwa wale ambao mtakao baki hapa sisi tutateremka kule tukifanya ile kipindi ambacho kilichosalia ni padogo sana mahala ambapo pamesalia na Mungu wetu ni Mungu mwaminifu sana na Mungu wa amani awabariki sana.
nunca es lo bueno. Pero sí. Basi kabla tujaenda kuteremsha mwili tunataka kwenda kuomba tuombe Baba wa mbingu na nchi katika jina la Yesu Kristo tunakushukuru tunakuenzi asante kwa umbali huu ambao umetuleta Mungu wa amani tunakushukuru Tunapofika tamati hii Mungu mkuu ukatuelekeze katika jina la Yesu. Kwa sisi ambaye tulio hai Mungu wa amani ukatuimarishe tena katika jina la Yesu. Tunapoenda kuteremsha mwili kwa nafasi hii sasa imesalia baba ukatuimarishe sisi ambaye tulio hai. Zaidi pia ukasimame na familia nzima katika jina la Yesu. Tunasema ni asante. Uimidiwe mambo okofu wetu. Na katika jina la Yesu Kristo tunaomba na hata kuamini. Farin pati pati chai. Shadat am. Mambo mteremshe. Farin pati na nchi katika jina la Yesu tunakushukuru tunasema ni asante asante kwa ajili ya mambo mengi mema ambayo umetutendea tunapofikisha tamati za mwisho Mungu wetu kapate kutuimarisha katika jina la Yesu tunakushukuru kwa maana umekuwa Mungu mwema na katika jina la Yesu Kristo tunaomba na hata kuamini
Wacha familia yetu odongo Tumalizi Basi wacha na sisi tukafanye atuwa ya mwisho kama vile mungu Alivyo nena na adamu pale kwenye shamba la Eden Na kamuambia maagizo Na kamupa agizo kwamba Maana hakutenda haku kulingana na maagizo yake Mwisho wake atakufa Na atakapo kufa lazima atarudishwa kwenye udongo Maana yeye ni udongo Wacha tukasome mwanzo tatu kumina saba Mwanzo tatu Kumina saba Na kamuambia damu Maana uko ya zisikiza saudi yangu Na ukasikiza saudi Sauti ya mke wangu Mke wako Mimi na kuambia Mimi nilipo kuambia Kwamba usile mazao ya mti Inchi imelaaniwa Kwa sababu yako Na wewe utakuwa ukila Kutokana na jasho lako Miba Na kila haina zita, Zitakuwa zimekuwa Na wewe utakuwa ukila Ata matawi ya shambani Katika Katika uzo wako Jasho lako utakula mpaka utakapo ku mpaka, mpaka utakapo rudi kwenye mavumbi hiyo ni agizo la Mwenyezi Mungu aliyeagiza kutoka kwa Adamu maana alipopewa maagizo kwamba asile yale matunda ama lile tunda la ule mti na akusikia akasikiza sauti ya bibi yake na alipopewa hiyo tunda Nyoka alipo tangaza, alipo danganya mwana mke Na akampatia akala kama yeye Bas, mungu akamwambia utakufa Na inchi ikawa imelaaniwa shauri yako Kwa hivyo wewe utakuwa kutoka kwa jasho lako In, Inchi itakupa mazao Na utakula kwa ajili jasho la zima uchoe Mpaka utakapokufa urudi kwenye vumbi Maana wewe ni mafumbi Kwa hivyo siku ya leo Daniel amerudi kama ile la agizo la bwana alinena. Kwa hivyo naomba familia ije ili na wake wake waje karibu ndio turudishe ndugu yetu kwenye mavumbi. Naomba waje karibu Ruth na wenzako, watoto na mama yetu kama yuko karibu arudi. Tu connais Mchanga Pale? Wabi Mami. Hii mchanga tutatupa mara tatu Kwa jina la, ba, la baba La mwana Na ya roo mtakatifu Wacha niulize Tungaja ome Haya tuombe Baba wambingu na inchi katika jina la yesu Tuna kusuku Tumerudisha mabombi kwa mabombi Mchanga kwa mchanga Nawe mungu kajitukuse katika na kila hali katika jina la yesu Kwa sisi ambaye tulio hai mungu wa amani, ukatuimarishe, ukatuelekeze, sawa sawa na neno lako. Katika jina la Yesu Kristo, tunaoba na hata kwa amini. Fari mpati, pati chen. Shadows, am. Fari mpati, with a magazine of three values of blank cartridges standing lot.
Barul Putri Jen Rosalut Present Om Jadis Om Barul Putri Dismiss and salute Dismiss Basi wacha tukapewe ombi la mwisho ndio kila mtu awe huru kwenda nyumbani. Tuombe. Tunaomba. Baba wa mbingu na nchi katika jina la Yesu Kristo tunakushukuru tunaliinua jina lako. Tunasema wewe ni Ebenezer kwa umbali huu ambao umetuleta. Baba tunapoenda kutawanyika kurudi manyumbani umekuwa Mungu mwema tangia mwanzo na hata sehemu hii tena ya kurudi huko muaminifu bado katika jina la Yesu. Jamii hii Mungu wetu tunawafunika katika mabawa zako Mungu wa amani. Ukawalinde, ukawahifadhi, ukawadumisha katika jina la Yesu. Simama pamoja na wao na hata tuendapo tena na kupatana na wao hakika hatutakosa katika kukushukuru na kulinua jina lako katika jina la Yesu Kristo tunaomba na hata kuamini noti ekati tungechadhi kwa MC atavaniendi undube kwiku basi ni asieta vika mudia wa ondwati ikwete yaani police service Ima mina wera me kwete wo ma mina wea wo yu ati wa wo la wito une kulia wi li bala wo eba ai ata nge se me iyo baba iyo ni baba wuri zio kia ze nge baba na ana ke ma ndue no a yu ze nge a baba e mi mba aga mo yu nenge ze be ini mo yu nenge ze be ti ka mo ka wuri dule kito a ka ma a ze a ma ya wi zo ze a ma ya a wo ma ze nge iba ana ke wo Ni kwa luke, anduma alama kuna rosa mizizi wa bidangge, ni yoyo bani kato kwa ne.